afternoon, everybody. I'm Tom Vassell. Where am I look? Hello! The <laughs> name is Oryx Stonequeg of Hill the Animals. I'm oh. Willa. I'm Roy. I'm Joey Evans. You, you see, you started so high. Nobody can match that level. Hi. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, you Mr. Crab. All right, so we are playing through a Ooh. campaign here of Dungeons & Dragons, sort of, um, called sort. The Four Coins, and uh, Four coins. we are... Let's, we are uh, in episode five here, so episode five. we're going to introduce the characters, and maybe they'll have something interesting to say about themselves. Maybe. And then we'll do a quick recap of where we're at and go from there. So let's start with uh, Joey's character. Nope, start over there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Fine, we'll start over with Z's character. I already Forgot got the juice. Point. I already got the poop juice. Well, I, you still need to introduce who you are. To Fine, my name is Oryx Stonecrake. I'm not going to try very hard, though, because I can't be super blessed again. Okay. Right? I think? Probably. I don't know. Uh, anyway, um, here's an interesting thing about me. I'm resistant to poison, it turns out. And it's <laughs> either it. because I'm a... <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm a poison dragon. It's either because, uh, yeah, your charms don't work on me. I try. I try. Okay, I'm no, like, you're not immune to poison. You're resistant to poison. I know, but I'm Can like, we test this? No, I mustn't. Okay, it happens a lot. I don't know if it's because I'm a dwarf or a sailor or my experience points are milestone. I don't know what it is. They're mid. You definitely put no effort into that. What are you talking about? No, I have a good one. You want to hear the good one? I do want to hear the good one. Fine. Okay. Um, I came up with a decent one. I, I did a little more. I retyped this up and took the stuff you gave us and added my own stuff, tried to weave it together, and I got a good one here about why I stopped sailing. And I stopped sailing um, because my best friend, an, a high elf by the name of Belcoron, was taken by the waves, and since then I have sailed no more. And have only tr become a traveling bard, going on adventures, uh, just going basically where the land takes me. And I no longer feel that connection and kinship with the ocean. Um, I should have went first. <laughs> That's really good. See, that was good. And I can't give you one of these because you already have it. But I can say now your food thing will work twice a day. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh, no. oh man. Just you, just you wait, folks. All right. Your turn. <clears throat> um, I did not come up with anything at all. Um, Oriana uh, was raised by her grandfather in town, as we know from her background before. Uh, when he died, she was very, very sad and did not attend his funeral because she was so sad. But she knows he's okay with it because when she woke up the next morning, the flowers were blooming outside of her window. Mm. There we go. Oh, that's Aww. a nice Hallmark right. story. Oh, thanks. There you go. It's very sweet. Yeah. Thank you. That's good. So uh, Tok's father left um, after a family tragedy um, back in the day, and I left me, after my mother died, I was kind of like left abandoned and orphaned. And I've kind of resented my father in some ways, but also in other ways, kind of like wanted to like seek his approval. Like, why has he left me? Like, why am I, have I been abandoned? And cause a lot of those trust issues that I have. Um, but uh, with having received word from my father, maybe there's hope of like rekindling the relationship. Oh wow, you got word, okay. Ooh. Oh, no pressure, but we all have poop on deck. <laughs> Here we go. Poop on deck. <laughs> poop on table. <laughs> all right. I'm Morgosh. I actually grew up in the city of Temple Walk. And actually I grew up with my father, never met my mom, but I actually first loved cooking. And that's how I got to know Cardinal Cardinal by cooking at his Cookery. Cookery. The, it was called the Cardinal Cardinal Cookery. I really, that's not a thing. <laughs> the Cardinal Cardinal Cookery. That, is, be, it that, that should be canon. The, great cook, the CCC? Is no longer around. The so CCs. Be canon. I still enjoy dabbling in cooking and alchemy, both together. Um, they're very similar. Yeah, I mean, they're very yeah, similar. They are. They're they really, are. I think you just put up random words together. Yes. I oh, you got poop. Pity, pity poop. I get poop. Pity poop. <laughs> That's pretty much what that was. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna put this in my cooking. So in our last episode. <laughs> That's alchemy. <laughs> so. Oh, natural. In general, these guys are from a fantasy world and have. Uh, they initially started off on an adventure embarking looking for artifacts. They did find a couple of those artifacts, mm -hmm. which and last mushrooms. week they turned in to. No. Um, oh, sorry. Huh? You don't want Sorry. me to eat the mushrooms? 
I don't trust anyone. Right. Don't go in the yeah, garbage. Garbage. Not yet, They don't turned in their things to the great wizard Bill, who uh, came in. But the, uh, lots of problems right. have ensued. Many of the uh, adventurers going into this area have died. Wait, 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 wait. I kept mine, right? I kept that. He tried to catch yeah, the, one, the two you found, you turned in. Oh, yeah. Okay. It was great. I thought you said all of them. It was an accident. You, uh, they've, they've run afoul of one of the adventurers, Squizzik, uh, who... Betrayed us? Not really betrayed you. He was never good, so it wasn't the like he betrayed you. The one guy we trusted no, for half a second. We didn't trust him. our trust. That's how a betrayal works. And he stole several babies from a friendly village that you guys went to. You've rescued most of the babies, but there's still a couple missing, and so you're on foot a a baby. chasing this guy. The great wizard Bill showed up recently with a portal, and the hippo who you were protecting disappeared and went back with him. Finally. Oh, <laughs> Sir. So it is just the four of you plus two comrades. You have Frosho, um, a cleric who also leveled up with you, and oh, good. then uh, Elfin. Did he level up? Not a cleric. <laughs> You're not sure if he has levels. He's he has got sort of mas levels. mostly one level. Yeah. Levels way of up insanity. here. Levels of insanity. I love him. And so in the last episode, you fought a warehouse um, and defeated it. And rescued the warehouse. babies who were inside. Mm -hmm. Guaranteed. <laughs> <laughs> Can't use the same joke. Two episodes in a row. I'll take the poop back. But I'll take the poop back if it happens again. Also, that was Z's joke, so... Uh, <clears throat> I can call back to Z. That's okay. Anyhow, you guys just decided to continue down the, the following the trail of the Squizzik who took the babies. That's I'm assuming what you had all decided to do. Sure. The last one. So they came in through that portal. I convinced him to stay, mm -hmm. if I remember correctly, right? Because you gonna... really convinced him to say he was going to go because his girlfriend is not responding to him via yeah, their yeah. little portal. Yeah, text my bobber. Right, his beeper. Um, you also convinced him to stay. Yes, you did. Because he was going to go with the hippo. You were a very convincing guy last episode. It's a good day for All you. Right, okay, we kept our party together. You know, I'm glad. I like those yep, two guys. Yep, yep. So I do have, too. They're good for our party. all the guards and wizards and everybody. Everyone is gone. Is gone. The portal has popped. So uh, I have something to say. So I received this letter from my father, um, and I mean it's pretty basic. Are you gonna trust overall. us with this? But you cry? when I turn it this way, it says, uh, "Don't trust the Earl," which seems like a given to me. Why would I trust anybody anyway? I, I look. I, I know I wrote that letter. Turning it sideways doesn't work that way. The first letter of you can use says don't trust the arrow. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> turning it sideways. If I turn it like, like this. Can I make it the shape of a word? I can now read the words on here. Wait. Um, who's the Earl? Do we know? There, there, there's earls mean? in Skirrell. each of the cities, right? Or okay, the Earl, like the, like Earl the, big, like... the big boss man. Okay, but it also the says one that, that we just gave the artifacts to? Sure, I mean, by... No, yeah, you, you just wizard. gave the artifacts to the, the great wizard Bill. Bill. Bill, yeah. Okay, okay yeah. Bill's yeah, not yeah. the Earl. Bill might give him to the Earl. We don't know. I don't know. I'll Bill. help you catch up. The Earl is the guy who was running the laboratory that you found. Oh, the dead guy. In the white lab coat? No, he wasn't no, he there, the but he was the guy running it. Oh, so, okay. Right. Got it. The lab I mean, really like. And they said at the time that he was there that he, that he was <laughs> that the Earl was trying to bring back monstrosities to this world. Well, I also, I uh, won't go into details, but I also uh, shared a, uh, I, 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 I had a, let's call it a premonition. Let's go with that word. I don't normally get burnt at the stake for saying that. Um, that I should stay here uh, and keep looking for artifacts. That's why I was very strongly opposed to going back through that portal. Wait, you have premonitions? Don't worry about it. Let's move on. I Maybe premonition was too strong. Uh, let's go with. Uh, dream. I had a feeling. How about gut a feeling? feeling in yeah, your a gut, gut feeling, sort of in my head, where I see pictures. Probably. How I, often do you have what? Listen, are you psychic? You know, what what is going? Going? No, gut is very you long. You shouldn't say about babies, this? though. Yeah. Uh, wait, what is happening? Why? No. It's just you know. Sometimes I have this feeling. It's just a feeling. Got you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Right. I got a feeling. Always trust oh. a dwarf's gut. Do we trust Thank each you. other? Like, how did we know each other? I don't really. doesn't trust anybody. I you actually did not know each other until you met and were here. put into if this party. Anyone. Remember you were the last ones picked? That's yeah. right. Look, I don't not trust amongst. you guys. You guys are losers. Last picked. Right? So yes. are you. All yeah, of you. Like, I'm aware. Of, <laughs> I am very aware the of my status. Replacements. Anybody. Okay. I yeah. trust okay. That's what the last time I openly share. <laughs> the, portal, the portal is just snapshot. You have done a bit of sharing here. Okay. 
I'm Junior wiping away tears of, of sadness of for, sh for sharing. Thank you, Christina, for being a super fan. Hey, yo. All snap. Hey, yo. Also, I should mention if you're watching this, so we're running a Kickstarter right now. Oh, and okay. if you want to see more of this, go back yes. to DiceHourKickstarter.com. Yes, yes. .com. All right, so where are we at? All right, we're finding babies. Yeah, let's 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 walk. How many do we need? How many babies are we missing? Do we know? We're I'm missing still one more. There's still right? two more. Two more. Two okay. more babies. Man, a Frosho, pair of babies. Frosho produces this weird, like clattering stone thing that he has. He mm -hmm. says, "If I use this, it can show me where the the brush has been recently traveled. I think ah. I can trap the guy." Yeah, let's do oh, it. Okay. I have something like You're that too. Hold Frosho. on. Right. Frosho knows what's up. Do that. I have something Pro like show, that. Some new spell or something. All right. Well, while Camille's searching for a spell, Frosha starts slowly walking, using the stone. It's following basically the path that you were on. So it's not like it's really going beyond that path. Okay. So where do you see your spells? Since you're you're all traveling for a bit here, I want everyone to roll a perception test here. Wow! Oh, snap. Is that the twenty? Um, Ooh, it's a twenty the plus your perception skill. Uh, I got an eight. Perception. I don't see perception. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Down here. I got a twenty-five. Wow! She critted. By the Camilla, way, you oh, hear critted. you hear something in the trees above you, rustling up above you. Mm, okay. The twenty. She just hears something. Okay. I tell Roy to yeah, look up. That's how perception up. works. She got a twenty. She no, should she, know their did backstory. Did she roll a natural twenty? She rolled an actual twenty. Well, she rolled a natural twenty. I apologize. Plus five. Well, I know. I, I know you had to plus things. She oh, you're a natural twenty. You you see a, a humanoid shape moving in the trees above you. <clears throat> oh, okay. I. Sh you could tell us. <laughs> You really don't trust people, do you? <laughs> wow. I'm okay. Okay. So I don't know. Yeah, my spells are on the last page. On the last page. Okay. Um, I have the. How, how do you feel? Do you have a feeling about this person? You're all about feelings. No, I don't have any <laughs> feelings. feelings. What are you talking about? <laughs> that was a huge mistake. <laughs> all right. Well, Camille's making right, it too I, long I, here, so I, 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 I call out. An the arrow above comes us. flying down at. Oh, you, Joey. That's why I didn't know if I needed to get the first shot in. Y'all didn't give me time to think. Uh, it hits and you. Thank you for that, oh, by the way. See? It hits you. Take your time. <laughs> <laughs> Joey, you're going to take, um, well, one damage. It just wings oh, you. Oh, you're fine. Oh, oh, it could have been just an acorn, honestly. Wound. How do you know it was an arrow? <laughs> How do you even know it was an arrow? It could have just been an acorn. I barely felt that. Okay. I'm, I'm not going to put the uh, up the things up here. You all can just do an action right now. So now we're Got fighting. It. Okay. Okay. Um, he's way over the tree, right? What it is, okay, did you have a, did you have like a longbow? I don't know. It's not equipped. I couldn't figure that part out. You can out. see it looks, looks mottled we'll colors. So it's a humanoid shape, but it's the trees are kind of thick, so it's hard to tell exactly what is it is. Is it a baby? No, it's an adult size shape. Okay, so your longbow is right there. Longbow. Where? Right there at the bottom. Okay. I don't know what the quality is, like how much plus you're getting and how much it hits for. Do you know this stuff, Tom? What order do we go in? Are we doing initiative or does no, it No, you can all go in any order at this point. Yeah, longbow. Um, if, they, if, they if, 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 if you're rolling for an arrow, you roll that and you'll add your, your dexterity bonus to Should see I if you hit. This? A 20 side die plus your dexterity bonus. And then the longbow will tell you how much damage it does. I don't ha I have the longbow, but it doesn't One give D8. me a stat on it. 1d8. Yeah. Okay. If you okay. All right. So I will shoot it's it back. Plus one, yeah, Let me help you. Go ahead. Do your thing. Do your dexterity. Shoot him back. Uh, uh, 13 plus two, plus two, so 15. Uh, you miss. Your your arrow hits the trees and the leaves and stuff and comes down. Oh, wow. What? Wow. Okay. All right. I meant to say not 20. All right. <laughs> you can only say that so many times. Um, can I see what I'll Yeah, so chat wants to point out that Joey's no longer an adventurer since it hit you in the knee. <laughs> <laughs> Oh happens. man, you're done. That I guess guy. you gotta go back to the portal. No, back to protecting one of the cities. And, and yeah, you're done. Um, okay, I'm going to. I should have a spell here that does something fantastic. Uh, give me one second. I am going to cast. Thunder wave up on the tree. Whoop. Oh, okay. Okay, oh, that's, that's, that's a good one. Yo. Yeah, I don't have that. Thunder wave. That's what I'm missing. Uh, do I have to roll for that? How many times can you do that a day? 
I don't know. I see your sheets. <laughs> I think one didn't print. I don't know what there that means. Probably once. Time. One action, I guess. No, yours printed even differently. Uh, duration is instantaneous. All right, so Thunder Wave. Z it can be done. Let's see. Blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna say, yeah, you can do this once per once per day here. So everyone has to make a constitution saving throw, not a problem. Uh -huh. And he failed that, so he falls out of the tree. Whoop! So yes. you see a lizard man um, fall from the tree. Oh, I have a picture of My actually. people, I, I mean. Cool. Wait, I thought he was humanoid. It's humanoid. Well, humanoid means it's not like a monster. It means it has a head and arm sticking out the side of its it body It looks like a human legs. outline. This guy here. <clears throat> Falls from the tree, that's landing in there. Outline. Now that's not an exact. He's, he seems to be badly burned, um, and uh, some weapons clattered to the ground after him. And he's scrambling around trying to pick up his weapons. Okay, got it. I think we speak to him, right? We just yeah. Let's I try know. He seems brother, scared. why are you attacking us? There you go. He's like, you tried to kill me. You shot the first arrow. I have dumb, done no dumb. such thing. He is just. He is pretty mad. That, that that you do not remember him. Sorry, it's the lizard guy. Oh, we don't remember him? You name him so you can drop off. Oh, yeah. Uh, lizard cat. <laughs> I forget. Uh, hang on, I have his name here somewhere. Liz dude. Liz Bowen. Liz Bowen. Liz. Would you like us Prismon. to finish the job or will you stand down? It seems to be four against one here. He's like, why did you Five try to kill one? me? When did we try to kill yeah. him? I want to. I want to point to the arrow in my arm and say, "This yours?" <laughs> and hold it out. <laughs> he points to his arm that's all burned. He says, "Is this yours?" So where was that from? Yeah. So he, he's looked, like, "You didn't free which, me," and then you set everything on fire. Did you know this guy? Oh, I. Is that one? Is that where he's from? Oh, that's where he's from. That okay. Place burned. I think. How about oh, the abominations? Okay, let's finish the job. <laughs> That was her. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was me. I was just saying, I, I didn't blow everything up. Yeah, oh, we yeah. didn't know I definitely he was in there. Up. We could just be like, oh, we didn't know you were in there. Yeah. He's like, you look through the window at me. I'm going to say, do you have allegiance to the Earl? He's like, who is the Earl? Okay. We have a common enemy. The Earl is the one twisting and mutating all of the creatures. And He's the still pretty steamed here. He wants to know why you tried to kill him. We weren't trying to kill you. We were trying to get Let's rid of abominations see. that the Earl was creating uh, no, uh, to no, bring terror back to the about. land. That's right. What are you talking about? Let's charm him We just admitted to trying to kill him if we say that. No, yeah, no, we weren't trying to kill him. He was a bystander. He's an abomination locked in if one you of wanna, rooms, guys. If you want to help us stop the person who locked you up in the first place, then stand down. He, he's... You need to roll persuasion check. Come yeah. on! I got charisma! Let's go! 14 plus. Telling someone oh, to stand this down. Is what, this is what? The stairs, Tom? A long I have the 18. Yeah. Alright, so he's yeah. he's calming down a bit here. Actually he's calming down. He's like, three because of he, he mumbles an oh, so apology to towards you. Okay. Oh, yeah. okay. He's like, I, I thought you were trying to kill me. We do okay. have a medic here uh, who could maybe help you out with some of your wounds. Pro shows like completely oblivious to everything. <laughs> he's doing the stone thing like this. Blah, 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 blah. Z has healing too, though. And um, El Elfin is like, you want me to kill him? Oh no, gosh. boy. Down. <laughs> <laughs> We're trying to so don't you understand have... him first. How were you locked in this place? He says, I He says I was stolen from my village. And I was locked in there for I don't know how long. And they were performing experiments on me and injecting me with chemicals. Hmm. Okay, what's your name? Frismog. At least they let this guy come of age before Frismog. they did that to him. They did that to him. Well. But he says... That in a weird way, you don't know. But that's how we spell it here in 2024. <laughs> <laughs> it, it our goal seems, is to have more I NPCs it, in our party than actual people in our it party. It seems like we have a common enemy <laughs> in the Earl, the one who locked you up. We're on a quest to find and stop him. Do you want to join us? It's like, I don't know who's good, who's bad. Well, apparently the person who locked you up is not good. So We're just I, gonna lean into he that. says that is an excellent debating point. <laughs> <laughs> I used to go to debate class in my village. <laughs> point to Gryffindor. There we go. Okay. Which was the name? Fine. Well, Gryffindor was the name of their debate club. Oh, uh, coincidence? Spelled differently. 
Okay. One F. That's how you say it here in 2024. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're from the uh, the estate of uh, Potter World, that's not Potter spelled. World. What he is says, that what called? Is Potter World? The book. That book. Potterverse. What is that symbol called? The Wizarding World. Thank you. All See, right. I knew a huge nerd would know. All right. So you gonna join us? Do you want to go with You're us? You're welcome to join us, but we're heading out right we now. We are currently we got these looking for babies. to rescue babies. There's no My better guys. call. Okay? We're not the bad people. Do you not like babies? He's like, I want to go back home. They're delicious. <laughs> He's like, where? I don't where. Okay, then we wish him the live? best. Um, he comes from the province of... Man. Um, Quebec. No, he comes from... He comes from a small village called Mushkab, and this is near uh, the city of Scoffrey. Well, we'll be right Who's from here. here? Mm, I'm from First Axe. Nope. I don't know where Scoffrey is. I'm from I mean, I think, I mean, I, or something. He, has, he hasn't really convinced us that he axe. would be good for our party anyway, so I think we just tell him, like, hey, we're following these stones. We're going. You're welcome to join us, but... Shoot us again, we will decapitate you. Your well, choice. Him not be bummed. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. We're going. All right, roll persuasion to check. No, I'm not trying to persuade him. I don't care if he does or not. Intimidation, then. <laughs> I don't care. I already told him we were going to blow him up. Like it says this. four against one. I mean, it's not very one. high. <laughs> it's eight. It's eight plus. What am I doing? He's not. He's not. Kamal has not convinced him one way or the other. No. All right, then we're good. I, just, I didn't convince him. I was just telling him what we're doing. He has options. We already told him what we're doing. Right, so let's go. He, he, says, to come he with says, I don't know where to go. I guess I'll come with you for safety. Is this a dangerous area? If you we. shoot us. <laughs> we'll try not to burn your other He says, I saw a gigantic bear it wasn't that I managed dangerous. to dodge. Yeah. Okay, well, All stick right. with us for now. We'll see if we can heal you. It's the least we can do. Yep. And uh, maybe you can share some of your wisdom and things you've seen with us. All right. All so, right. Do you want to try and heal him? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice snake on the healing spell. <laughs> Just make a little band aid, put it on him. That's just fine. You're good. All You're right, good, buddy. <laughs> I've got this bad boy once per day, Chris. <laughs> I burned I'll tell that. you what, if I it's midnight and I haven't used it yet, yeah. you got it. <laughs> I make things 59. go boom. I All right. So you continue walking down the road. He walks with you. He's not a very talkative person, although Elfin does run up next to him and is peppering him with lots of questions. Okay, at like, least this peppering get burned? was not with buckshot. Yeah. Like, how'd you get burned? And <laughs> he mutters some things like, does it hurt a lot? If I slap it, will it hurt? Asking that. Frosho realizes he's there and is interested, but he's still following the rock. Because okay, that's what you told him to do, All and right. he's taking it very seriously. I like this Frosho guy. He's growing okay. on me. Does Frosho okay. take us to one baby or both babies? Are we going to know? He's just following a whole wave of rats. No, Frosho is not. He's, he's just. He's just he's ranger babies. style. You just, just someone has come down this way, right. and you're following. So you go on for another bit, and it's starting to get a little darker, but you come to a, a, a clearing, a plain there, and there are some statues. Um, standing there. There's okay. two big statues. They're about 10 feet tall. They're both humans. They're both like in full plate armor and they're facing each other looking like they're trying to fight. It looks like a setup for a battle type thing. But they're, well, they're just there. On the ground in between them is a sword and a spear. Um, on top of that there's a little mound coming out of the ground to some degree and the Frosia says the stone goes into the mound. I don't understand it. Um, can we do right. like a history check to see if we recognize the figures or anything like that? Oh yeah, sure. I don't know that I'll be good at that, but I, oh, I don't know. I failed. I, failed. <laughs> oh, my God. I didn't even come up with that idea. No, no, no Roy, if, if, if you think you saw them in a comic book that you read a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Okay. Uh, from comics. All right. Okay. Uh, does anybody have the ability to uh, check for magic or anything like that? Isn't uh, that your Ar thing? Arcana? No, I'm negative. Are the guys actually holding any weapons or No, they're not. Do they have holes where weapons could go? Yeah, they do. So they they I think we could probably put these weapons in these guys' hands to maybe open up the thing. Let's do it. That's possible, yeah. Alright. Alright, who wants to be the one to walk up there and do it? We're gonna stand back and watch. Any Frisnog and Fro show. I'll do it. Or her. What am I rolling? Nothing, you're just Oh, I did it. Just put them in there? Wait. So what do you do? Which person gets a sword and which one gets what was it, a sword and a spear? Well, okay, the one guy is doing this, that's the and the other guy. guy is doing this. That's the spear right. guy. Oh, that's, that's the spear, spear guy. Let me roll for perception. <laughs> Let me roll for perception. I got a natural 25 somehow. <laughs> okay. All right, so I put the... 
sword. I'll do the sword. I think I want to do the sword. I'll put the sword in the sword guy. Wow, they look just like in my comic books. Okay, so when you pick up the sword, <laughs> you hear a small rumbling, and you put it into the guy, into the statue, and the, it is, it just stands there, but it starts swaying a little bit like that. Okay, all right, so they've been, they've been charmed uh, or something, right? Spear. All right, so then I put the spear in the other guy. Uh, okay, in so his hands, same thing happens, him. but as soon as that happens, they both start moving and they both start attacking each other. Right. And so the spear guy is stabbing the spear guy and the sword guy is hitting him. It looks a little bit like clockwork figurines. Like if you ever seen oh, the things okay, that come yeah, out of the yeah. clock and they're like, Wah. and they're not really doing much damage because, well, they're made of, of stone. And so this goes on for about two minutes. Do we notice we anything watch. in the mound in the middle? The <laughs> well, the mound is off to the side, but actually after two minutes you hear a ding, like a microwave ding, and a door slides open from the side of the hill. And they stop, and the weapons fall out of their hands. Oh, I think we'll go okay. in there. Okay. Let's right. go. Okay, cool. Let's go. Is that mound still Let's just a mound? mound? It's about the size of a, of a, of a person. Like the, the doorway is the size of a, a human. Well, the mound is just a mound there? The stones went there, yeah. though. Is one of the babies Always buried the door there? leading to that we need mound, to, like, though? You dark. <laughs> The Good stones grief. that lead wow. to the baby. Please tell her no. <laughs> no, listen. What I implore you. The stones lead to wow. the mound. No, there's a, okay. Let he me explain. The stones Let me explain the what I mean by mound. I mean a small hill, like like a man-made. Oh, now oh. I got a pile of dirt. Oh. And got it. Oh. And back on the side, oh. side, side of the door mound. in the side. I'll, Okay, oh, I understand now. I understand. Yes. 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 On the mound is a door. But also, I'm going to step door. outside by DM to say, there's no babies buried here. <laughs> well, technically, <laughs> if we go through the door and the babies brave. are through the door, they're kind of underground and they're kind so of buried. Right. So, right. are you, we going to walk through? I can send my eye, but I'm going to waste one say, eye. Do you still have the eye? I still have the, wait, did I lose the eye? I don't lose my eye. I still I scratched it up, though. I got stepped on it. That's okay. There's still great. Can anybody fix this thing? So I don't. My my uh, spells Thomas didn't print out. Do you have them? They didn't print out. I just no, think that was a really difficult puzzle. Page. What's that? No. It was really Let's see. Thing. This is just like. Well, what's tricks. your next page? My next is my history. How much stuff you got? Let's go. You got the lot of stuff. Let's right. go through yeah, the door. Yeah, that's weird. So I got mine I don't here. Know. So do you have them? Because I did get. I think I got what, one. What spell are you asking about? I don't know. I just I just chose some before this, and I don't remember what they were. Oh, yeah. oh, do I have you your? Have oh, I have your stuff. character. Yes, I don't know why I'm asking this. I have your whole character. Your spells are you have um, absorb elements. You knew that. Entangle. Speak with animals. Thunder wave. Are you copying the Z? Thunder. I got it first. Absorb dun, 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 elements. Dun, 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 locate dun, dun, object and locate object. summon oh. beast. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, buddy. That's summon a the, beast. Yes. That's where oh. a wolf came from last time. Remember that? Wolf. Missed Jimmy. That wolf. No, that was because I ate a mushroom and had a. a what do we call it? A vision? Premonition? I only have feelings. <laughs> 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 I've never had visions or oh, things that right. visit me in my dreams. <laughs> I just sometimes have a grumbly tummy. Absorb elements is the other. I think you need to mushroom it up for you in there. I think so too. I was thinking that. Was Frosho has put a stone away and is talking to the lizard guy Got and it. giving him salve to put on his. I'm gonna have breakfast. Wounds. Okay. The mushrooms? Are you eating a mushroom randomly? Great. Yes, a pretty purple one. All right. Let me pull up well, my here mushroom. Go. Here we go. Here we go. Do you want to eat it? No, it looks like these dice though. It does. A baby Ew. sniffer. I don't know. What color is it? Hot purple. <laughs> Pretty purple. All right. As that comes in, um, you hear the you hear the uh, the lizard guy say a, a fairly vile curse word as he's talking to because he oh. steps on his toe. Wait, and wait. He wait says, and, and the lizard says a very vile curse word to Elfin because oh, no. Elfin's just running around. Yeah. And you oh, realize no. suddenly you can understand everything in every language ever oh. for a couple hours. Like that. That's pretty wow. good. That's okay. Pretty you know, let's go find a city. Like every language. Let's go find some beasts. For how long do I have this? Like two five hours. years? Two years? Two hours. Two hours. Year and a half. Oh, so I'm going to go ahead and say Alphon. This is not a negotiation. <laughs> I'm going to tell Alphon also since he's, Are there multiples he's of the stepping on people. I don't think so. What's there? You can't. Are there multiple right? mushrooms of the no, same color not. on there? Yes, there are. You Maybe. could, like, you know, I mean, write down so what I'm each of the colors do. I can't look, though. I pull it out randomly. But then next time when you pull the color out, you would know what it does. Or I could ask the DM. Then I put him out of a job. <laughs> can't do that. Thinking, right. Right. So thinking of, I'm also going to call Alphon. Alphon, come here, boy. Come here, boy. Stop stepping he on He jumps in his shoulder. He's like, what? All right. That guy could be an enemy, you know. I know. All right, let's go into the grave. 
Mount. What? Wow. Door. The it's not a grave yet. The door. Let's go in the door. Okay. Five. Right. Okay, how are we going in there? Who wants to lead? Does anybody Mr. have a Hit light source? McGee over here is going to lead. Does anybody have a light source? Uh, I'm going to have a ton of light sources. There. I've got dark vision. I mean, I have dark vision. Yeah. I have I mean, dark there's, vision. There's light coming from the thing, and you see kind of a hallway. Or like some, oh, I'm sorry, sorry, not hallway. It's, it's, there's stairs going down. I do have a torch. Okay. I do. I do. Let's you go. Sure? Oh, Where'd you right. get it? Do uh, I have a torch? Am I carrying a, a torch? Sheet. I probably have a torch. You have a torch. This is the other thing you said is they're possible ones, not what we have, right? No, no, that's true, but I do have things over here, like I have a... Uh, uh, um, I have thieves' tools. These are my proficiencies, not that. Oh, I don't have that. I got my... Where's my sister? Alright, I will use my... Wait, do we have to like turn on dark vision? How does that work? Is it a no, button? No, no, you dark vision it. just works. Oh, so I have dark vision too. What am I worried about? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, so you can see, you can see yeah. down the stairway. It's There's like okay. a dark stone stairway going down. Alright, let's go. You lead, right. I follow. I got this. And I got You're following on for the real, shoulder. right? Yeah. Okay. Go. I'll go in the back. So we'll keep the, uh, these guys we don't really trust. Alright, you're going in first? Yes. Alright, roll a perception test. Perception. I've got a 17. Good. That's good, but not good enough to notice a little thread there uh -oh. that you trip with your foot. Uh, all of you need it, 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 a, a bunch of poison darts comes out, and uh, about to test that resistance. You all need to roll a <laughs> 16 to save on this. Is it like actual? So you're rolling on your uh, re one of your resist three resistance. Which one down at the bottom What's there? What do you got? Constitution? Yeah, here? yeah, roll constitution check. I also have poison resistance. Shoot. Strong My constitution. Up here? Oh, that's not good. Oh, you suck at that. I do really suck at that. You I got an 18. You're yeah. good. I and I did not pass. That's an 11. I do, however, have a resistance to poison. And that's going to come in handy. I also have a resistance to poison. Erwin, roll a d8 for damage. D8. Even me? Yeah. I got an 18. Oh, then you're fine. A nat I got an 11. So what, what do we need to get no, to, to not, not get hit? <laughs> huh? What do we need to get to not get hit? An 18. Oh, I had an 11. Oh, really? <laughs> I have so 7, agile. but I also have resistance. I have 4 in resistance. So you're taking half. Uh, no, 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 you're taking full damage, but the, the poison is going to... You're going to be continually taking damage, God, but you so will not. You will take four. less damage from the poison. I'm Holy taking smokes. four hits right now. Yeah, seven is a massive amount. I got of damage a three, to so I'm going down. Oh, it's a pretty big here. dart going hit in the forehead. Ah, uh, great. I get it. All right. Yeah, that sucks. Seven damage. Now we're poisoned. Oh yeah, I need to roll for uh, the lizard guy who dodges it swiftly, and I hate that guy. A, wow. Elfin like leaps and does some matrix style thing and lands oh, back in the shot. Oh, he's a beast. Okay. Oh, he's like, oh, 18 oh, he's to get to miss. <laughs> he's terrifying. <laughs> um, okay, well, now that I know All where right. this place is booby trapped, I'm, I'm digging the dart out of my neck. And I'm going to tell him Elfin, this place has traps. You should go ahead of us and check for traps, little buddy. He says, done. He's off your shoulder and running down the hallway. I love him. Okay, okay I'm adopting like him. I don't care what that hippo lady says. <laughs> I really hope you like that. shows examining a trap. He says, I don't... Death. This looks like it was set very recently. He said, this is like a homemade setup trap. He's like, I got one myself and shows you. Okay, oh, cool. Okay, all right. He's creepy. He, says, I, more he says, I know exactly where to get these. He says, it's not creepy. It's Do you know how animals. to dodge them? Because okay, my neck right. hurts. I, I oh, Frosho it. didn't roll for the dodge. I'm sorry. Frosho's like, no. Nah, ah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, he knows all about traps. And uh, into it. Okay. where is? I'm sorry. There we go. He knows about everything. Yeah, he, he took does. he took four damage. Okay. So he's he's, he's, sa he's, he's putting salve on his wound, and he has some anti poison stuff that he's drinking out of a little ah, vial. This guy. Okay. All right, we go down the stairs. Yeah. Well, now he's leading the way, so I guess we can cautiously follow. Yep. Yeah. Right, mm -hmm. I'm still in back. I will confidently follow. I will cautiously follow you. I'm ready. Okay. All right, so you're going down the steps, and you get down to a hallway, and uh, Frosho comes, I mean, Frosho, Elfin comes skittering up to you and says, I don't see any more traps. No more strings. Mm. Okay, Except but I found this little string. What's that? And he's just a little string. He's like, ooh, can I keep it? Yes, of course. Like he sticks in his pocket. Like That's yours. Tail. Come on up here, boy. He he jumped up to your shoulder, and just when he jumped up to your shoulder, he's like, <laughs> Oh. Oh. No, he's like, I'm back! Well, I was really enjoying the silence there for a little bit. <laughs> oh, 
don't want a second what asylum. Is, I do. Like, what do you mean? Right hey, now. No, it lasts days and days. Right. Did you pull that all like, the way or just? No. <laughs> like, yeah, all the way. Oh, right. He's man. a fantastic fighter, guys. I can't sleep. Yeah, he's he's our charm pull spell him on him like your sure. first action in a fight. No, I don't want to wait that long. <laughs> I'm already eight. playing that flute at that point. Blowing darts and fools. Oh my gosh. All right. All right. All right. So there's no more traps. He has, you said, a rat tail in his pocket or something? He has a little string in his that's pocket. All? Yeah, it's his. Okay. Do not touch the string. He's I don't want that. He, that string. He, he picked up off the floor. Yeah. That's he did put his mouth in his pocket. He's he also gross. has rabies, probably. Does he have any hand sanitizer? He probably does. Um, all right. So we keep going down the corridor. Yeah, so as you go down the corridor, you hear a clankly clank, and the door behind you is closed. Perfect. Mm -hmm. um, and now it's pretty dark. It's, it's completely dark. There's a little bit of light coming from ahead. There's a door at the end of the hallway, a little bit of light coming from that. Um, but other than that, it's dark. But with dark vision for most of you, you can still see the hallway's pretty empty. No doors on the side, just one door at the end, right? Yep. All right, we go. Okay. Yeah, we're looking. I mean, I'm going to be looking around, make sure there's nothing. I know the little fellow looks, but I'll you actually hear up. noise coming from behind the door, by the way. And it's mm -hmm. not like it's not like uh, some rustling. It's like almost like a sounds like a town. Are the stones uh, okay. working for a fro show again? Stones. The, 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 the I want babies. Fro shows like it, it, that only really works for me. This the stone on the outside trail. We're inside now. There's nothing really to follow. Okay. Got it. Okay. Yeah. All right, so we're probably coming out the other side of the hill. Right? Is there a keyhole in this door? No, just a door with a knob. It just opens. So the light is coming around it. from the outside? No, from the crack underneath the well, door. Well, that's what, yeah, that's what I meant. Okay. All right, All right. we go through the door. Let's go well, through the you door. You would try it first if it's open? No, I'm just yeah, going right through it. Works. Okay, so yeah, go open the door, and once you open the door, you walk out into a very large inside structure. So it's a big, giant structure inside, and it's pretty much, not chaos, but it's bustling for lack of a better word. There are kids there in front of you and they're, they're playing a, some sort of game with a ball, kicking it around. There is people, there's an old lady sitting in the corner, looks like she's selling bread. Uh, when I say lady and kids, these are all hobgoblins. Um, oh. Hobgoblins everywhere and there's like a okay. village thing going on. But it's inside a building um, that's made up of many giant rooms that you can see. And the rooms, like directly in front of you as you come out of the hallway, the room there is just glass. But some of it's broken and stuff. But everything is inside. I have a picture. This is kind of a... Uh, um, uh, mm. I had a picture. What do we know about hobgoblins? I can, oh, hear, I can speak that It's not quite, right quite what it looks like, but ish. Okay. All so right. you can see the like inside. A market? Okay. Like a market or a town square? Yeah. So and so the people there, some of them look. Some of the kids wave at you. A little girl walks up to you. She's holding a kitten and she's like, "Hi." A and kitten? says hi to all of you. Did you say a kitten? Oh, yes. Sorry. I immediately so terrified of kittens. Pull out my sword. You see me get and start running kitten. towards the kitten. Why? What's going on? I, I magic missile the kitten. Not a big fan of kittens. <laughs> <laughs> I put my sword away and I walk away. <laughs> what is going on? Wait, I thought you were attacking the kitten. We were going tag team on this kitten. Yeah, I I, I can't let that kitten live. Why? What's happening? What is Should we stealth on? mission the kitten? What are we missing? What? Let me see that letter from your father. <laughs> Read the other side. Well. <laughs> what happens if you turn it this way? You know what, it's oh, wait, did you really magic witch kill the kitten? Well, I was about to, and then he we stopped the kitten. kill the kitten. He stopped you? No, he oh, stopped. I'm not gonna stop him from killing the kitten. Did you? Are you still going at it with the sword? I gotta kill the kitten. Okay, okay. so he's running towards the kitten. Well, as he's running towards the kitten, I, I try to magic missile the kitten that the girl's holding. That the girl is holding. Yeah. You know she can take collateral damage from this. I mean, she's a hobgoblin. <laughs> Magic missile doesn't miss. What's Magic missile doesn't miss. <laughs> no, it, well, yeah, but she'll still take damage. I'm That's freaking fine. out. I'm, 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 right I'm assuming that lizard focused. guy, as he's like, his <laughs> flames okay. are starting. Lizard guy must be I was freaking going to out. Kill the I run over to him and I grab him and I'm freaking out. I'm like, I don't know what's going on either. <laughs> and, and, uh, I'm going to kill the cat. Yes. I'm going to kill the cat. Chaos. That cat needs to pay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. So, I kill the, the kitten. What? Uh, I mean, I think it's just is being three D four. No idea what's happening. Three D four. This is uh, four, five, six. It's eight damage to the cat. Yeah, you killed the kitten, Roy. Right? <laughs> yes. Good. And the girl takes some damage, and she's sitting there just staring at this dead massive. <laughs> Does the kitten fall? 
We want to make it's sure it's on the stand. ground now because I will put my bad life <laughs> into the body of the kitten. <laughs> You caused this battle. We need to make sure that kid is dead. Don't, don't act like it's not your fault. The no, it is not my fault. You, you know. own your own actions. You know what you did. Yeah, so what? the kitten's dead, right? The kitten is dead. The girl yes. Perfect. leaves out this shriek. Okay, Other I try to disappear into the crowd. <laughs> stealth. Stealth. You stealth. guys are not stealth. 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 I, I fail. Alright. Just... Are you still running toward the kid at breakneck speed? Oh yeah, but if the kitten's dead, <laughs> I'm, I'm fine. But if the kitten's down, I'm okay. I'm glad we that kitten was making my idea. Enjoy the exact same idea. I don't idea. know either. Why does that? Uh, I don't okay, what so I'm gonna. Go? As you stop running, I guess I let uh, go of the burnt lizard guy. He is stunned. Fro shows stunned. I'm stunned. I am. I walk I'm over stunned. to him. No, I'm stunned. What? The cat is not stunned. Alfred is like, are we killing cats now? No, we're not. Yes. Oh my gosh, Hold no. On. We yes, we are. Calm this. down. I go to you and I spin you around and I grab you by the shoulders. So I'm pretty sure you're like six <laughs> foot something. I grab you by the, by, by the wrist. By the <laughs> and I'm like, what's happening? Those animals can't be trusted. Is all I'm going to say. Let's move on. They can't be the cats trusted. can't be trusted. I turn into a cat. <laughs> Are you serious? No, no, no. no, 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 no <laughs> that no. line's about to come right back. <laughs> why can't they be trusted? I don't know. Why can't they be trusted? You know what? Well, I don't want to get into it now. I do. We okay. will discuss well, you're this about later. To get into it because but a couple right now, of hobgoblin guards come roaring around the corner. And, and, a, and, a, and a boy's like, points at them and says, It's them, sir. They're the ones who killed the kitten. And you hear this clearly because you understand hobgoblin. Yeah, yeah. Um, and they run up to you, and they shout again, it's a hobgoblin at you. Basically, what the huh? crap or whatever. It's a very hobgoblin word. It, okay. it basically, it's what the apple, but for them, that's pretty vocal. Like, what the apple? All okay. Right. I slowly put the battle axe back on my back. Actually, they're actually pointing at you. I'm sorry. They're taking it to Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. I was behind him. He was the one running at it. Yeah, so you are the one who burned the group. cat. Man, what the I don't apple? Know what I, just, I don't look at I'm just like, <laughs> I, just I did the deed and now it's done. I mean, I just I'm say just, I'm you're welcome. As I say. I say you're I say you're welcome. welcome. I put the battle axe back and I just say there's no need to thank me. Everyone is really kind of in shock there. I am. Yeah, 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 yeah the, yes. The guards are kind of like, what do we do? They're like stumbling around. So one of them runs off to get their, their chief. Oh my god. Okay. Who? Guys, I, I was not, I don't you're upset at me for yeah. turning Elfin back on. And now we're in a oh. heap of trouble with a whole town <laughs> oh of these gosh. things. We would have been a lot more trouble. If that cat would have survived. Can I see right. the clipboard real quick? I can't, I can't. Oh, there's, there's a decent amount of, of <laughs> adults. The, the, the kid's game has stopped. The girl's still crying. Okay. Yeah. And the chief comes up and Chief Rotnose, he introduces himself to you. Mm -hmm. um, and again, what the apple? Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm going to just kind of slowly, I'm like, oh, yeah, woof. Oh. Oof, I'm just slowly separating myself <laughs> from you too. I really am. I, I turn into I, a fly and I just like land on his shoulder, not the elfin shoulder, the other one. I don't trust that. Now one. I got I, I have like, beings nope. on both my shoulders. I don't know what's up. Okay. I have a fly right. on the shoulder. I just want to ask: Are there any more of those here? <laughs> he's like, he's like, not really. We've we've eaten most of them. We were oh, trying to help prepare them. Yeah. He's like, but this was one that my my daughter thought this was cute. This is the chief's daughter. Okay. We're trying um, to protect you. And there's a lot of angry murmurings and stuff. And the chief's like, listen, we'll let this go. You got to make restitution. Okay. Well, I'll get her a dog. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Whatever kind she, she wants. She immediately brains up. <laughs> and she's like, okay. Woo, a dog. They are perfect. Okay. I, she's sitting there waiting for she the dog. dog. <laughs> Whoa, what, what, what kind of market is this? Does she want a wizard? No, that's not okay. No? <laughs> that's that's okay. Okay. <laughs> a human <laughs> being. It's not a human. He's a lizard. Roy is right next to you. Oh, is he oh, a lizard? He is. Yes. Yeah. I was afraid of Dragon Man. <laughs> Yeah. This looks different. Yeah. Wait, do you have any more of those mushrooms that made the, the ghost dog? I'll like show you one, okay? All right. We'll well, I'm going to go up. I'm going to try to help you out. Okay? I'm going to go up yeah. to you and the little girl who are in this like conversation going nowhere, and I'll try to soothe her and say, would you like something yummy to eat? She's, she, she's, she's very excited. She seems happy about that. And all the kids are like, food. 
Perfect. Oh, okay. And at this point, you notice they're not like starving, but they're a little gaunt. Okay. Well, I don't. I only have a little food, but I'll give you something yummy as long as you'll all share. Or I could okay. summon a. Bowl. I hope okay. something disgusting comes out of it. I'm going to go ahead and get a bowl ready just in case. <laughs> 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 there is a bowl ready. And I pull out my magical enchanted coin. And I'm going to rub the side with the egg. All right, roll 100 side of die. Here we go, Tom. <laughs> oh, <my> gosh. <gasps> so excited. That is 15, right? Is that what that is? Mm -hmm. The town? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so Matt, uh -oh. this is like perfect for you. Butter. No. You have a bowl full of peppermint candy. Yes! Uh, right. They're All starving. Right. Why would they want... Oh no, it's God. fine. It's candy. They're children. They're going to adore this. Let so he is handing out the, the candy here. The kids are like going bonkers. The cat forgotten right now. Yes! Love You're it. welcome! Love it. You both owe uh -huh. me an explanation. So we take okay. At some point. I need that right. explanation. The kids are eating candy, and that okay. candy is gone something fierce. And now everyone's pretty happy about the whole thing. Okay, The, good. the chief's like, we, you know... I saved your butts yet again. <laughs> and oh. and the, the people start dissipating, and the chief's like, um, welcome to our village. Mm. Uh, the Spaza is the name of this village here. And uh, we have an, an inn here if you want to stay there. Thanks, He's like, um, I'm assuming you're passing through like everybody else who comes through all the time. Do you have a lot of travelers? He's like, oh, yeah, people are always coming through these. He says, we have several doorways into here. Some of them go farther into this structure. We have guards posted at the end here to keep. He says, it's, it's much more dangerous over in that direction. Mm -hmm. um, he says, but we also ourselves go out to catch food and bring it in. It's the only way we have food down here. Mm, how long have you lived here? He's like, oh, our lives. We've been here for thousands of years. Thousands. Mm, that's a big number. Mm. <laughs> he doesn't say thousands. He says apples. But it's a different infliction, so it's not as it's not it's as. A different uh, word. Better watch your mouth. Well, no, it's just you know some languages. <laughs> if you say apple, that's fine. But if you say apple, that's not okay. Right. Okay. I understand. Okay. All right. So do we go and check out some of these? I guess let's check out the town, around. right? Yeah, I mean, check it out. Some of these. Oh, you know what? I should ask him one more thing before you go. Have you found any strange items mm. lately? Ooh, Anything yeah. that seems out of the ordinary. Yeah. He says they might be at the, the trinket shop. He says old Jabobob sells them. You know how Jabobob is. How do you spell that? J O B O B O B. Jabobob. <laughs> Jabob. sounds. That checks out. Blah, blah, blah. All right. Um, so. Okay. Yeah, I'll save that. Um, okay. Can all we right, see let's go check it out. Anyone else come through that door? Hmm? That we just came through, right? Because oh. we know the person bring the baby to keep that door. He says we could ask around and one of the kids says that he saw um, a group of, of people come through. He describes an orc and a couple other people and uh, were carrying some babies and they went down towards the more dangerous part of the area. Got it. Okay. Uh, well, maybe we should get so it. It might have been a different way. group of orcs carrying <laughs> babies. <laughs> 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 they not, maybe unrelated. How often do we orcs don't carry know. babies? You know what I mean? Like, hey, this kid is high on pepper. Meanwhile, kids are starting to, to clutch at you and be like, more! I, uh, maybe tomorrow, kids. Okay. Frosho's like, I'm almost out of healing spells. We should rest. Yeah, that's a good idea. Okay. Okay, so do we ask the chief, is there somewhere we can rest for the night? The chief says, yes, there's an inn here. If you'd like to stay at it. This bad boy refreshes, right? After I sleep. Yeah. Hello, kids! <laughs> <laughs> it's Christmas! <laughs> Maybe. I don't tell them anything, actually. Don't promise It might be like, though. you know, unsalted butter or something. Okay, what do you... <laughs> so I'm going to go in a corner. <laughs> get my bowl out. All right, roll. Hold on, I got to do it right. Where's my other... There it is. Here we go. That'd be great if it's 15 again. It is 37. Okay. It's just one big head of cabbage. <laughs> They're going to be so excited. <laughs> <laughs> hey, kids! Hey, kids. <laughs> I, I call them over, not knowing what you're going to make. Come on over. Oh, no. We've got something great no. for you guys. No. Come on over. I went to a corner to hide. <laughs> Oh, I'm actually going to like grab it and see that it is a head of cabbage and be like, okay, well, never mind. I already told him tomorrow. <laughs> so I go up to the uh, lizard guy. I'm like, this is something you would enjoy eating? <laughs> He's like, no. All right, man. I eat bugs. I'm sorry, dude. There might be bugs in it. I don't know. Calm down. Jesus. I'm just trying to do you a favor. Uh, what do I do with this thing? Guys? Just put it in your pocket. 
It's enormous. <laughs> 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 I don't want it. You have a backpack a, or a, ra- a rucksack or whatever they're right. called. Just give it to the guy who runs through. Okay, let's take it to the inn. Get to the guy at the but inn. I we already slept. We can trade it for something. No, no, I used it twice. I had a special okay. ability where I could do it twice. Oh, I know you can do it twice. Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, take it to the inn. See if we can trade it for... All right, so the inn is a, a nice small... Stay the inn is a, a small building that has... I'm holding it actually the whole time. I'm gonna put it away. <laughs> it's it's kind of a weird looking place. Um, it, it looks like, again. It's, it, it looks like another nice. room inside the structure, but there are several cots in the back there, and there is a fairly serious matron like hobgoblin, and she's like a uh, uh, six six coins for the lot of you. Six small coins, silver coins. Do we ask about that? Do we have? I, I give it? them. I, I give be willing them, uh, to trade for the cabbage. <laughs> the cabbage, she's like, yes, you can have two. I'll nights. say, I'll pay for it. Takes the cabbage and she's gone. Oh. Oh. Okay. All right. I was we gonna have gonna do two something. nights. We got two days, guys. Without I'm money. <laughs> this cabbage is fire. <laughs> Maybe I should have had the cabbage. I know. Now I'm missing the cabbage. <laughs> right, so they are very. It's funny how that works. You don't know what you've got until it's gone. <laughs> they saw yeah, something. So they're very undernourished, then, it seems like. Okay. Oh, that's right. They so, don't yeah. eat. Yeah. Okay, well, let's sleep. Okay, let's go I'm just happy to sleep. Eat cats. All right, just so you know, at the at the entrance of this uh, establishment, there is a large, um, a big, large troll type creature that she points out that he's there for safety. He stays there at night, so you don't have to worry about anything attacking you. Okay. Okay. And there's also no one else, and no one else is sleeping there. There's no one else. She says very no travelers have come through for a while. So there's like creepy people hostel. in the hostel. Yeah, <laughs> like a hostel. Are we good to Yeah, it's kind of like a hostel. I mean, we I trust like, these people. I only have to sleep four hours, right? So it'd be all be up the half troll. the night. I think we still do watch. Yeah, still watches. I think 100. percent oh, okay. we sleep. I'm down first yeah. watch so let me go first. You guys stay up till midnight, and then right. I'll take midnight on. Wait, don't we normally do it the other way? You sleep first, and then I do the first shift. It doesn't matter. Also, man, I sleep now. Oh, and I'll take midnight on. I'm, oh, I'm okay, sleeping, yeah, okay? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm dreaming know, of like you're, a, yeah, you're a minty cabbage. <laughs> Who's staying up? I'm staying up first. Staying first. I am asleep until midnight, so it depends on what time something happens. Got it. It doesn't matter particularly okay. Okay. because you are so sleepy. It just hits you and you fall asleep anyway. So okay. you all fall asleep. Do we heal any hit points? So this is for each of you. Oh! Do you know. wake up and Which way do I turn it? <laughs> <laughs> That's our main reading first. Okay. It doesn't okay. make any sense this time. <laughs> We're okay. trying to figure out the. What? Uh huh. So wait, this is. Okay. All right. One well, morning comes. I hope you all had a restful sleep. Says Frosho, he's ready to go. Alfin is up, buzzing around. He's asking the troll so many questions. The troll has threatened to step on him twice. And the lizard man is just sitting on the edge of his bed, staring off in his face. Asked, did everybody sleep well? Cool. I say yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I say yeah. <laughs> I just, oh, I had some strange dreams. I did too. I don't feel quite right this morning. I feel fine. Just a weird dream. I just say ship shape. <laughs> did you dream of kittens, perchance? <laughs> no. No, most definitely not. You were serious about these kittens. Not a big fan. No kittens. A little fan? <laughs> no kittens. <laughs> No, I just... Okay, all right. I had some strange dreams. Must have been something we ate. I had, pe- I had, some I had a peppermint. I you did? That was for the children. The malnourished kids. Well, <laughs> well... I, I had a dream, I think, about something that I don't think I would understand. Do you guys know uh, anyone named Bobby? No, do you know Murray? No. Bill? <laughs> 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 Do you mean Bill, anybody? I just. Yeah, I don't really. Oh, do you have a name in yours that you. Sam? Yeah, I don't know. You said who, Bob? Bobby? Bobby, yes. That is. Nope. I had a dream that things were different. So. Yeah, mine was different. Like, I think there's something that I don't understand. 
The matron says, while you're all sitting around, says, hey, you want breakfast? We got boiled cabbage. Wait, if I have an immune... Is this a magic <laughs> sleep, per chance? A magic sleep is like someone puts you to sleep, right? Oh, yeah. Like yeah, magic sleep can put you to sleep, yes. Okay, okay, so I wasn't immune to something that happened. Okay, sure. so... Okay. Anyway, yeah, I'll take some of that cabbage, yeah, for sure. I've been... All right, so she has steaming bowls of cabbage, and I don't know how to explain it. Like, if you've ever imagined the blandest thing you can think yes. at the level of blandness, and this is blander than the bland, bland, bland of that blandness. It is like white rice in a bowl of cabbage and served with uh, tepid seawater. Mm. But it's filling. It sounds good and salty. Mm -hmm. There's no I salt. I do love white, I'll eat white it. rice. Seawater, is that right? Oh, I'm sorry, river water. There All we right. Go. So, yeah. we ate, so we ate, and now let's. Uh, a bit of a cook myself. I think we thank the troll for watching, and we go out and check <coughs> out the bazaar, right? He says, see you tonight. <coughs> okay, buddy. Oh, what's, his, what is, oh. what's your name, my good man? I'm not a man, a troll. I apologize, my good troll. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call yourself? Truck. Truck. Oh, I like that. that checks out. T R U K. All right, you know what? I'm truck, going to take out my troll. coin. That's I'm going to run through castle side and just see if I, I, I had any inclination troll. to go one direction or another. Okay. Oh, wow, yeah, okay. You get nothing from <clears> it. Hmm. It's so it doesn't broken. count for my day. I'm just saying nothing happens. Okay, so it doesn't Not matter. everything we do is a negotiation skill. <laughs> and, but make a roll for that. No, no. Uh, okay, let's go to the bazaar. All yeah. right, let's go let's start walking through the bazaar, see what we come across. All right, yeah, so it's a typical thing. You see people selling, there's knickknacks. You see, there's that old lady I said who says she's selling like small loaves of bread. You don't know what's in the bread. It doesn't yeah, look like fair. bread that you would normally would eat. There's yet. again kids running around. It's not a very big bazaar. It's mostly just people kind of standing around talking. You see a bunch of uh, looks like hunters all trooping off down a small hallway and disappearing. The mayor sees you. He smiles. The little girl who gave uh, peppermint hugs you, gives you, you dagger eyes. I uh, it didn't come from me. I don't know what you're talking about. At some I didn't point, do a thing. Uh, Joey just pets his axe. <laughs> I do. At some points, we do need smile. to talk about what yeah, happened. Yeah, we do need there. to talk. I think tonight. Prepare Maybe yourself. Tonight. tonight we're talking. Uh, unless okay. we pass out again, <clears throat> and have strange dreams. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we can see what you dream tonight. I just nod that we'll talk. Okay. okay. Anyway, the chief right. is like, "Hey, what's That's going on? Are you are you heading out? Are you staying?" We were hoping to explore the bazaar and see if there's any special trinkets that we thought might uh, perhaps contain uh, unique abilities, maybe uh, artifacts. Well, that of looks a sort. strange. Anything that's strange, like any strange glowing objects, because they yeah. glow. Ah, right? that, yeah. well, Jabab Bob is there. Any what was if only you had come again? yesterday. He's like <clears throat> that orc who came through. Took everything we had, gave us lots of money. Shows all these silver mm. coins. He's pretty happy. He's like, "But come back! The hunters always find stuff. You never know." We'll Do you here. know which direction the orc went? Yeah, they like they went out the uh, east of our of our city. Let's go out the east of their city. They, uh, well, we have one more free night here. Here's the thing. <laughs> Apparently, we were going to leave <laughs> today, <laughs> but he got two nights, and he's very cheap. <laughs> so right. apparently, this is a vacation. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not doing <laughs> that. We gotta go chase these guys down. Do we leave? Is there they, anywhere they else we can... They want to get out of talking about the cats. That's what's happening That's here. That's really what's we're, going we're on. Leaving I agree, with that. Out I agree with that. Is there anything else that looks like it might be... You are chasing people, so again, you can stay another night, but you're giving them a whole day. No, 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 yeah, we'll okay. chase them. That's fine. I'm just saying, is there anything else I think being sold here that might help us on our quest? Anything yeah. else we can buy? Weapons. We do have. There's a little weapon shop. You can go in there and see if there's any um, weapons. Maybe some armor. Maybe something. Like some money. I don't have much money. I don't think I'm carrying much of anything. You have money though, right? I have money. I got 26 gold pieces. I think I'm. I'm, right. I'm loaded. Well, yeah, I think I'm ready to go. Okay. Well, let's let's spend <clears throat> half an hour looking and seeing if we find anything. I want to shop a little bit. I feel like shopping. Okay. You know, at the cart. <laughs> All right. All right. <clears throat> so you go into the the little weapon shop there, and it's mostly just a bunch of... There's, like, some really weird small knives that are only sharp on one side. It's odd. They look almost like knives that you would use at a... Like a dinner or something like that. Like kitchen knife? Like only sharp on one side? What do you mean? Yeah, it's sort of like that. Um, and there's also some forks and spoons, and, and there's all sorts of different things here. But there's some... 
There's some uh, metal clubs and stuff, but everything looks pretty generic. Not much better than what you have now. But there is one thing that catches your eye, Z, mm. and it is just a. It's just a. It's just a sword, but it. But it seems cool. Like like a premonition. Like he has a feeling in his head with. Well, pictures? roll. Someone roll detect magic. I'll roll it. Well, I'll roll it. Well, what's the stats? Okay. I'm good at that. Um, Arcana. That'll be. I got 19. Well, you recognize a sword. It's, a, it's, it's called a Dragon Slayer sword. So we this need one gives of those. you. This is a plus one sword. It does 1d12 damage, uh, but plus one, so it's 2 through 13 damage. And if you hit a dragon mm -hmm. with it, a dragon will take an extra 3d6 damage. How much mm. for the completely ordinary sword? 3d6. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> How much for the completely ordinary sword? Oh, I'm going to notice that. He's like, it. oh, it's 10 points. I oh, you're trying to undersell, undersell him. <laughs> I thought you were trying to... Uh, no, no, no. I, I, I can't use a sword. Look at me. Like, I'll I give it to someone else. Mm -hmm. I'll, uh... Wait, it kills dragons? Yeah. I'll pay him... Ixnay on the... We're definitely killing him later. Okay. I'll, uh, <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Very excited about I'll that. pull out my coin and rub it a little bit and then hand him ten coins. I forgot, I forgot actually what Roy's coin is. Here's money? Shh. Oh. Are you kidding me right now? Are, just an illusion? are we now? stealing? First we kill their kids and now are we trying to steal the sword? Really? I don't think you have any moral high ground there. <laughs> yes. Why? What? It's very true. It was a kitten and a girl. Oh, that's right. Roy is, the, 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 the guy looks at it and goes, these are gold coins. I've never seen these before. We use silver coins around here. He's like, ah, Keep I can pawn them off on the next adventurer. Not a problem. He's very happy. He just suckered you. All right, wow. and I hand Z the sword. Is it an illusion? What is it? Okay, what do I have here, Tom? Remind me again. You have a dragon slayer sword. Okay. Where the heck is my sword? I like one of those. I know. Nice. You might be better at that than he is. Oh, yeah, the dwarf has uh, a you sword. No. <laughs> <laughs> I have a long sword of plus one because I got it at... Why are you guys having this very boring debate? Frosho has bought three forks uh, you take and it, yeah. a weird looking dagger. I've got the great sword. Uh -oh. How much money has he got? Oh, he managed to trade the guy a, a dead beetle that he found and a oh. few other odds and ends. They cool. did some sort of barter. 1d12 like plus <laughs> one. Also, Elfin. How, Elfin, Elfin, like, How much plus? I got another dagger. He's like, same as my size. <laughs> I want three daggers. Buy it for me. He's going to be like. Uh, yeah, 100% I will. How much? The guy's like two silver coins. Done. I have 26 gold coins. So you give him one gold. He's like, all right, two. No! What's wrong with you, man? I'd kill you right now. <laughs> I give him oh. two silver coins, which means I now have 25 gold coins and eight silver coins. Right? That's how magic. That's how D&D. <laughs> yeah, like, saying D&D. Who makes change? Well, yes, it is. But <laughs> Thank you. He's saying that D&D. The guy's okay. like, I'll take the two coins. He takes two coins, and then he's done. And, and Alpha's like, the dagger's mine! And sticks it play. in his back. So he has two daggers in his hand and one sheath behind him. Yeah, I love I it. I hope he uses it with his mouth like Zorro in, in one Yeah, that's fine. That <laughs> would be a copy, and if there's one thing we don't do in this game is copy anything. Nope. Oh, I'm sure. All you need. Okay, I'm down to 24 gold pieces. Oh. Uh, fine. Um, okay. um, what, if this dragon sword to hit, would it be plus what on the hit? It's plus one to hit, so whenever you roll, you'll roll. You'll add plus one to your attack. Yeah, but like and other, plus one other, damage. Other stuff is like plus four, plus five. No, I mean. plus one to that. Oh yeah, so you do the like plus your long five. sword is your. So you have the long. The sword. long sword is plus one already. Yes. That's why it's a five. So this is also plus five. Yes. Yeah. All right. Done. Why not? Um, okay. okay, cool. Do we need anything else? Are we good? Everybody happy? Cool. Nope. Let's, let's go. Let's chase right. him down. Actually, before I let's go. go. Wait, what? I got it. I feel bad for these kids. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> there's no kids around. You going to call them over first? No. 100% percent i do it. It's I'm not calling them over first. All right. I don't know what this makes. I think we should, though. Right. If you're willing to... If you do that, I am not creating food. <laughs> Why? It's been good. They take it. I thought it was us against the cat killers. I'm helping you. I'm giving you some rapport and renown and notoriety. Well done. I, we can do this after okay. I see what the food is. You don't want the big moment? I don't want the big moment. They don't Especially need to know it's it magical stinks. food. When it, when it stinks. Has he started to rub it? I'm getting out. I'm getting I just out. see a kid out there and go, No! <laughs> Wait, hold on. Here we go, a bowl. I got the bowl. <laughs> and a slowly <laughs> crowd starts <laughs> gathering behind that one kid. <laughs> Here we go. It is going to be, Tom. There we go. 54. You go. It's three plums. 
Ooh, that's a very specific number. Pick the three skinniest kids in the class. <laughs> I go all of them and bring them over so, subtle like. Okay. Right. Oh, someone just asked in chat, can you re-roll for better food? You could re-roll with the, you, if you spend your unicorn you poop. poop. Oh, I have poop. Three pumps is not bad. It could have been. It could be it cabbage. Could, <laughs> could they, be they love the cabbage. You. I, I think you're limiting yourself because oh. of the quantity. I think, I think it's cabbage. Quality. We're going to be here for a week. I think you need to re-roll. I you know, just as a man, this could help me like kill things. I'm not re-rolling for those stupid Don't, kids. What are you hey, are <laughs> Skinny, get over here. He's a plum. Yeah, all the kids so friend. happy sitting there eating a plum. Yeah, he like so. shoves the whole thing in his mouth. Does not that's know how a plum works. Okay, I don't care. It's probably fine. About to get pitted. Yeah. Let's right. get out of here before these kids don't realize there's a pit in it. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> it's I give away the three plums. I feel good about three happy kids. There's a couple kids that look very sad, but yeah. Well, you know, you can't please everybody. Welcome to the world. You do what you do. <laughs> they right. be glad right. we're good. Yeah. They we go out. We're good. Here? We're good. Did we take extra hit from the poison? Uh, your resting healed. The poison also Frosho gave you some poison things, and also I forgot. No How's <laughs> our lizard one. friend doing? Do we heal any? He's, he's with you. He's just as kind of there. He's still, oh, he's still wrecked. wrecked. Oh, Frosho gave him something, wrecked. but he's still pretty scarred up. Emotionally or physically? Yes. Physically. Oh. Emotionally, he's a lizard. True. What are you trying to say? Good point. I'm definitely very emotionally scared. Yes, that, that sword would do 3d6 extra damage to Roy, too. Ooh. Remember where it came from. <laughs> yeah. All right, the next kitten you oh. missile. Forge. All right. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. We're following the eastern door. Or the eastern okay, well, so path? you're going through, and, and again, this... this this structure is big. It's filled with big hallways like that one there. And on the side of them are lots of different buildings. And so uh, you're not really sure where to go. But Frosho talked to the mayor and he says, I, I know which way to go. And you go and you go down to one path. And halfway through this path, there's four or five guards standing there. And they're very wary guards. And they're like, are you going out into the thing here? We're think following a villain. Yes. They're like, well, this is where everyone has come. And he goes, but be careful. All sorts of nonsense out Have there. Have you seen Oryx? Some Oryx coming through with some... Like, oh, that was like yesterday morning. Okay, yeah, then we're, we're going this way. Let's roll. Is it a morning? Oh, goodness. Where's so the guards time? allow you through the gate, and then immediately guards are like, you're welcome back when you come through, but we'll have to check to make sure you're not carrying any dangerous creatures with you. Like cats. Oh, yeah, keep, I just mumble I like, those out. like yeah. kittens. Mm -hmm. no, he's good. Yeah. Okay, all right, bye. As you're walking away, you see a little girl come up behind the guards, and she waves at you all. But she makes a very obscene gesture towards you. It basically means apple. It no, yeah. it's, like, it's, like it's like an apple. apple. It's it like, looks like <laughs> an apple, and then she puts a little leaf on it, like this. <laughs> <laughs> like worth, that. worth it. It's worth it. It's worth it. Okay. All right. Okay. So you're walking down this path, and you're, and there are these stores next. To, there, are, there are these. Like, again, you're still in this big structure. You're not outside or anything. So there's all these, these rooms there with. With like big glass windows, but they're they're fairly broken and everything, and there's not a lot in them. This is run down. Yeah. But as you get like it. as you turn the corner, the, it turns like a sharp corner there, and also there's small hallways going off of this. But as you're following the big hallway, um, I, I need one of you to roll perception check. Perception. perception. I'm not that good at that. I'm, not that I'm only plus perception one. Perception so. for me is zero. plus three. That's you. I got zero. Yeah, I'm, I'm one, oh, that's so. persuasion. Perception is a little oh, far. Let's so go. Okay. Oh, yeah. You gotta be our yeah twenty. It? No, well maybe I don't know. We don't poop it yet. Do you want to poop it? Poop it. I'll poop it. Wait, do you, you go. poop before you roll? Yes. You have if to. you're watching, poop is what we're using. <laughs> <laughs> um, to get I didn't roll those times. <laughs> Ooh, I'm glad I pooped it. That could have been the first one. I have a twenty, not nap. <sighs> okay. Okay. So you notice that this one room that you're walking by is like webbed up. If, like, if, if, if you were in our world, you'd think it was a Halloween store, mm. you know. But you also see a wrapped figure in there wiggling around. Oh my God! Uh, okay, wrapped, all right. Wrapped, wrapped. A wrapped figure <laughs> wiggling around. Wrapped. Yes, yeah, like, like in a web. Like a mummy. Yeah. Like yes. Stuck in webs. Yeah. Somebody got caught in a web. Okay. Yeah. Like Have Frodo it. Baggins or Bilbo or one of them. Why don't we have? Both. Why don't the we have Elsa go cut the, the cocoon open? He might get caught himself. But yeah, that's probably the lizard guy mumbles. We should walk by. That's what you guys are best at. Oh yes. my god. That is messed up that's right there. That, no. Or we could catch it on fire because we're better at that. Ooh. All right, oh, so these two are going to come to blows. Lizard blows. All right. Okay. So. Do we want to try to. How big is this bundle that's wrapped up? It has a person in it. It looks like a human sized bundle. 
a little smaller than a human. All right, so tell Elf. Looks like a human child be. almost. Like dwarf size. Yeah. Yeah. So. No offense. <laughs> He might get caught in it. Then we gotta go in there and save his butt. Yeah, but that's then true. we're not caught in it. No, I'm not leaving him. Okay. Fine, I'll eat a mushroom. Oh, don't, don't, no. You didn't have an excuse. Oh, you just wanted an no. excuse to eat a mushroom. Why? Right. Uh, it's a no. new day. No, stop what? eating the nasty, the poops that the mushroom produces are disgusting. <laughs> don't eat the mushroom. <laughs> How would you know? It's a mushroom. It's oh, already gone. Jesus. Oh, no. What does it do? Okay. It gives you a diabolical So the end of diarrhea. your fingers become real sticky, and you can, the end of your fingers become real sticky, I'm and you can climb walls. That wait, 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 wait. And this lasts. Does webs for, stick to me? Does webs? I, I don't. I guess you'll find out. This will last for two hours. You're a spider okay. now. So yeah, wow. if, if, okay, if I have sticky, it. so I can now rip open the cocoon and it won't stick Done. to me because I have web powers. Let's go. Get yeah, in there and that's check what out I do. Up. My web powers. So you walk in the store and you're starting to rip the web apart. Yeah. Well, as you do so, mm. out of the shadows comes two spiders. Okay, there it is. I shoot them with my web. I was web. shocked that there were spiders in the web area. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did not see that coming. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> All right, let's roll for initiative, baby. You're oh, fighting some magma, magma spiders. That's what I'm talking right. about. They're shooting right. fire. I don't okay, want Okay, initiative plus three. Uh -oh. I'm I got pretty six. good. I got 17. Oh, I'm oh my I'm goodness. Be I'm a 20. I'm not going to work very good. I have five. What'd you roll, Z? A, a one. Okay, you're last. What'd you roll? 20. Right? I rolled 19 plus 17. One, so 20. And you rolled a 20. And Frosho. Well, Frosho rolled a one. Oh my. Welcome to my world. And then. Uh, Elfon? Uh, Alpha, I roll Alpha. Oh, wow. this guy rolled a seven, so he's here. That's your lizard guy. I don't have a little thing for Alphon, so we're going to use the. Uh, well, he's just going to go when Z goes. Makes sense. All right. There's two of these large spiders. They are pretty big. Um, Please let me know the initiative order. Really uh, Morgash is going first, then Tak. What then what eats spiders? No, talk, that's talk uh, is Roy. You say snake. Bird, right? And then the uh, the lizard guy Bird, um, right? that they like with, like uh, with them. Griffin. Then the magma oh, spiders. Yeah, yeah. Then Camilla. Then Z. Then Frosho. All right. Wait. So I'm. Oh yeah. I'm very last. Each. No. Z is last. And oh, Frosho is last. Technically. So each of these is very. They're pretty large. They're they're bigger than a human actually. Um, and they are coming at you. Mm, wow. Make it happen, so more guys. All right, let's do this. So what are you doing? I'm gonna run out. Are they right next to each other? They're, no, they're coming from two different spots in the room. All right. I'm gonna run into the one on my left there and swing my great sword. All right, roll to hit. Here we go. That is a 14 plus 6, so that would be a 20. You definitely hit him. Roll for damage. There we go. 2d6 plus 4, slashing. That is 8 plus 4, 12. Ah, you chop off one of its legs. It's down to seven legs. It hisses at you. It's going to cool. take a while. All, All right. right, Roy. Um, um, I don't think fire is going to work very good against these things since they're, uh, are they like glowing red and stuff? Yeah, like they are glowing red. Are they magma spiders? They are magma yeah, spiders. Yeah, I'm not going to try to fire okay. them. Use um, your ice powers. I don't have those. Um, I'm going to <laughs> magic missile one of his other legs. Let's go. One leg each. Uh, well, that's terrible. Uh, four damage. Actually, that does knock another leg off, but he is still okay. coming. Six more to go, guys. Right, we're getting there. All right, the lizard gentleman pulls a very long pointed sword, like, you know, the fencing type swords okay, out, okay, and he's right. like, that death I stab at you. It's the first time you've, uh, he, you've seen any kind of emotion from him. He's so he runs up to the same like one that. and stabs and completely misses. Okay. He, this guy's not very good with fire, not so I don't know if he should be getting that close. You know? Alright. Okay. Oh, the, uh, okay. oh, can just a little bit of fire? Well, Joey, the first it's spider that attacked is attacking you. Get it up and What's your, uh, never mind, I can see it right here. Oh. It Hits you, it bites at you. You need to no make class. a constitution save, oh, please. Oh, man. Or you'll take poison here. As long as you get an 11 or higher, poison. add your constitution bonus. That's not good, Joey. What did oh, you roll? You should have pooped it. Plus four. Ooh. Yeah, you should have pooped can it. Can I poop it? You can do it later. I'm, I'm nice. Throw it to me. All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh. There's nothing if he wants. That's Shoot. worse, bro. Yeah, we'll take the higher ones. It's an eight. All right, so, Joey, you are taking... Here. Oh no! Um, damage. Do we? 
<laughs> did Ooh, we heal my long good. rest or not? We didn't, did we? You healed, yeah. You 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 will be healed after the last. Oh, thing. well, oh, yeah. okay. I thought I was still dead. Joey, you take eight damage, mm. but you're also taking. Oof. Are you resistant to poison? No. No. Nice punk. So you're also taking no. some extra poison damage. You're taking five more poison damage. <laughs> so 13 damage total. Where are you at now? You started with 28? 15. Oh my. The other magma spider die. decides to shoot. Magma? Turns around out of its butt and shoots a fiery strand around the lizard guy. Okay. Not again with the fire to this God. guy. Completely misses. Good. But he oh, screams wow. in horror. Yeah, I, I would too. Jeez. He's bailing okay. it. He's right. running. I feel bad yeah. for this guy. I'm right. doing. Mean? Birds it's eat. Hard. Birds eat spiders, right? Birds. Birds. Yeah, Is right. there anything else that eats birds? Yeah. I mean, spiders. spiders. Oh, lots of things eat birds. Cats, for example. <laughs> you know what eats cats? Roy. <laughs> yes, I do. Because like, I, I can summon a beast. I'm thinking about Oops. summoning like a big bird that would like help us eat it. That might work. Yeah. I was like that, or ah, it could something be, like, ice. Or, like, no, a, no, ice. I, I can't think of that. I was like, or like a griffin, because it's like the eagle. These, these things aren't gigantic. Head, right. That's what I'm saying. If it's a griffin, it's the eagle head with the the horse. Yeah, right? sure. So go for it. All right, I will. No, no, no. You can't summon a griffin. Why not? Yet. It's a beast. Summon beast. Summon no, a dog. It's you a beast. A griffin is actually a it's a monster. large monster type creature. You can't summon that as a as a thing. You're summoning an, any typical animal you can think of. Then summon like a tiger or something. I don't know. The tigers eat spiders? They'll also, attack. Alright, I'll I'll is summon a tiger. Like, well, yeah, I need to know I what I can uh, what can I summon? Summon beast is you're going to so let me pull it up here. So we'll tell. I'll tell you what Summon Beast does because you're probably do this a lot. You're going to call forth a bestial spirit. So it's either going to be an air, uh, land, or water creature. You pick which one it is, and it's going to fight alongside you. But it's it's not like a tiger level strength. Think more like dog level strength. Okay. So if I get a water beast, that'll put out their magma, right? Also a it will also flop around like a fish. Oh, it has to be in water. It's not. I thought yeah, it's the spirit. Not I thought it, it doesn't make water. It lives in water. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, okay. that's what it means. I think just an animal land type. Do you pick though? Yeah, she can pick which type of spell to do. You're afraid it's like your food? <laughs> you can roll some dice. I know, yeah. I'm like, go oh, a land type, and it turns out to be like, a I don't know. No, no, no. <laughs> you could say whatever creature you want it to be within reason. Like, you could say it's a tiger, but it would be a weak tiger, if that makes sense. Yeah. Like, it takes a certain number of hit points. Did you uh, say cat? That's 30 hit points, which is actually a lot. So it will last pretty long. I'd recommend it gets a tiger. So you could say a tiger, yeah. but just it's not going to be like a real tiger. So it doesn't matter. It's like I'm just... Yes, I you could say what it is. Let's go back. Or what I summon. <laughs> so we're going yes. to kill it. Sure. So I summon an otter. An otter. Great. I'll, I'll allow it. So an otter comes out. I love it. And the otter runs up to the spider. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hits it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. I like that look. For 11 damage. Yes, it does. <laughs> just rips off that is right. one of his legs. And That's just boom. messed up. Okay. Thank you. Wow. Okay. All right, Z, what are you That's doing? How you do it. I'm just uh, uh, watching in bewilderment. I'm like, it's crazy. That's an otter yeah. tearing into a spider, y'all. Yeah. Wow. I pull out my journal again. Uh, and I, like, <laughs> your diary today, you're not going to believe what I saw. <laughs> no, I'm going to go ahead and uh, swing my long sword at this fool. It's sword plus one. I guess we'll focus fire here. I'll go towards the one that's hurting. Was it the same one? The otter attacked the same one? Yeah, sure. Okay, here we go. Uh, plus five. 13 plus five is 18. That's one, a hit. One D, damage. One D8 plus two or plus three, I guess. I don't know. Four, seven. All right, it, it, it dies. It falls down and dies, and it starts making, it starts pulsing a bit, like boom. Mm. Mm. Uh, you could have understood these things, couldn't you? No, it was two hours of oil. Yeah. So, me, so uh, Elfin does a flying leap from yeah. your head to jump on top of the other spider. Go, boy, go forth and kill! Do it. He does some very Matrixy style <laughs> moves there, having rolled a natural 20. What? And lands onto the eyeball of the spider. <gasps> He Kill it, boy! downward, doing six points damage, and the eye juice flows, and the spider roars in eye agony. juice. Yes. I like it. All okay. right. So he can't see good. anymore. Frosho casts a healing spell at Joey. 
Yeah. You're here for four hit points. Ooh, all right, all right. I'm back, back to you, business. Joey. What are you doing? All right. Can I run towards this spider now? The other spider? Yeah. Sure. It's right. only like three feet away. Yeah, you right, can run. 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 Do it. Just imagine it's the kid. Run like the wind. I'm going to run. And I'm going to hit it for... Uh, 15. Hey, 15 works. Hey. Yeah. Go for damage. I mean, it's no otter, but, you know, we'll take it. It's... That's, That's a 10 good. plus Ooh, four, 14. Okay. Wow, you take out two of its legs. Yeah. Hello. Right. So you learned how the all legs right. work now, so you can I'll, do two at a time. Oh, it's a leg. Oh, it's a leg. Figure that's all like wrapped up. Like, can, uh, can I just run over to it and like cut it open with a dagger? He's like 10 feet into the the, the room and it wrapped up. You can run over and start cutting it. I'm going to try to run over there and try to start using a dagger. It's to... really sticky, so it's going to take a while. You you chop the string, and Dude, the thing falls in the crowd, and you hear, a, you, you hear nothing. Just you just hear the body hitting around. You don't hear any sound well, come from the creature. Like he lets the bodies oh. hit well, the floor. Up so much. <laughs> he does. We I did let the bodies hit the floor. We did. Well, I let the bodies hit the floor. floor. Listen, that's what I do. But know. but you can't tell because it's wrapped up that much. You know, like so much body. you can't see what's in it. But we it is know definitely a body. You guys see it, me run off. Oh yeah, there's some wiggling. It's alive. It just made no noise. You guys see me over there yelling floor. Here go. Next one. Go. Next person are the spiders. So the one spider. Wait, what about Gekor? I thought the one was dead. There's only one left. Yeah, well, right? hang on. Oh, crap. So the one spider oh, tries no. to bite you, Joey, and ends up tripping over its leg, falling down, and taking six more damage. Yeah! yeah. Somebody oh. roll a one! <laughs> <laughs> this guy, uh... Oh, I forgot about that guy. You're right. So the Echoer stabs at the spider right before the spider had a natural one. Um, he could just take oh. a moment to collect himself, honestly. Now Gekor trips over his own feet here. Oh, no. Oh, his dice only have one on each side. He need a dice jail for that thing. Yeah, dude, that's two in a row. Wow. Oof. Um, where is it? Oh, not too bad. He just drops his sword. Oh, okay. And he's standing there. Okay. But it actually right. is a little bad because at that moment the other spider oh, no. explodes. Uh, that's why I got out of the there. You didn't, know? One? you didn't know? These things explode. The one I was I pulsating explodes. Okay. And it's going to do 10 points of damage to everyone around it. So that's 10 points of damage to you, 10 points of damage to Elfin, which starts him on fire because he's wooden. Um, 10 points of damage to, uh, to the otter. So the otter starts. It's down to 20. Doesn't take any damage. Yeah, it has some damage to it. Um, and 10 points of damage to the other spider, which kills it, and it starts pulsating. Yeah, I'm out. All right, Camilla. Yes. Did I take 10? So you weren't thing's... close enough. So this thing Didn't is you pulsating. Stab it with your sword? He stabbed with the sword, right? I was no. on the other one already, wasn't I? Oh, no, you are there. Oh, I'm, I'm the one who killed it. Okay, yeah, I 10 got points damage. You're right. 10. Sorry. Okay, fine, fine. All right, so this thing is pulsating at this point. I'm going to go I'm pretty good about around my to the back the side of the cocoon so that I'll be blocked for when it explodes and start working <laughs> on opening the cocoon. So this is clear. You're using a cocoon you could try to put yeah. out as a shield against the explosion. Yes. yes, and also trying to like open it on the other are side. Are you sure you know what being a hero is? What? No, it doesn't. How, I, how am I going to stop it from pulsating? You want me to like... No, but you're using a human shield. A human body. <laughs> it's a cocoon. It's like wrapped in pillows. I'm over here yeah. just like, what, is what, what are you doing? Work. <laughs> Pillow wrapping. Got it. Okay, that's what you're doing. Yeah. All right. Next. Are you, are you trying to open a cocoon at the same time? Yeah. Okay, so you're slicing it open. Fine. I'm using the cocoon as a shield. I'm um, a person out. Z. I'm a hero. What are you doing? I'm going to... Put out Elfin. He's on fire. Wait, wait, when's the outer go? I'm going to grab him and pick him up and like, ah, 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 put him out as I'm He's running away. He's also screaming because he really hates fire. Yeah, I get it. When's the otter okay. go? Oh, that's now. Good yeah, that's know. right. The otter, what do you want to do? Against Try and put out Elfin. <laughs> that's what it's going to have it do. A spirit it, couldn't do that. They can't, what can they do? Attack or something. But they, they can couldn't. attack? <laughs> oh, fine. It'll be here. It'll attack the pulsating thing. Or can it go make like, can it like... Surround it with its spiritual essence. It can try that. We'll it see can. what happens. I All right. I like so. that. I like Thank it. Surround it. See, what it, you're putting out the <laughs> Alpha and Alpha is too shocked to do anything on his turn. Yeah, he's fine. I'm grabbing him. I'm putting him out, and I'm running away with him. Fro show casts a healing spell on you, Z. Oh, nice. Heals you for four damage. All right, that's some. There you go. I'm a 22. All right. It's me. Yeah. 
All right, so as um, I'm going to run and hide right outside the door, but as I do, I look at Oriana holding up that cocoon right in front of her like this. I'm look not, at I'm her like, What's the matter with you? <laughs> she has to hide right outside the door, so I don't get any collateral damage. Oh, I'm the issue. Still you're looking like at her hiding like, hiding outside. So you're, you're just booking for it? You're I like, boogie, but I also get the side eye like, Okay. Well, I'm being I, helpful at the same time. I'm still trying to get the person out, like I was last round. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, they're they're coming out now. Uh, and then what is it? The, the, this guy. It's like a Kinder Egg surprise. Yeah. This guy is. He is turning and just. He is just running. Okay. Away or out, towards? Out the so door. Much for his sword. His sword is just gone. running away from the magma spider. Okay. The magma so spider explodes. Everyone is pretty much far away now. Just kind of. See. Okay. So or no. The otter. <laughs> Oh, you have the otter. That's right. The otter. The, otter's down the otter takes more damage. Ten. Okay. There's some quiet now, except for the two people sawing through the cocoon. So the There's battle is essentially opening. Roy has been there the whole time. I've been there the whole time. Okay, so coming out of the cocoon. Okay. How's how's Elfin doing? <laughs> That's huh? what I care. How's the how's Elfin doing? The fire's out. He's shaking. He's actually not said a whole lot for the He's last quite minute. Oh yeah. my gosh, that's like a day and a half for anybody yeah. else. Okay, so yeah, once you guys rough. finally them tenderly. get the cocoon out, you recognize who was in it. Oh my goodness. It's a little alien dude and he's upside down. I guess he was cocooned upside down. Who is it? He, he gets out of the cocoon and he's like... <gasps> Are you kidding me? Oh, Wait, but no, wrap him back up. What you wrap about? him back up. He was yeah. huge. What are you Bring me about? some webbing. Okay, he's back. You mean like it's that kind of creature? Because that one was like really big. Hey, no, you can, you guys are, are can recognize him. It's the same one. Oh, okay. Just curl up in a little ball, I guess. All right. You okay, love that so, guy, you say? I love that guy. So it's as it. you're looking at him, he looks at you, Roy, and... Didn't you understand him? Says no, nothing. Don't. Says nothing, but in your mind, you see a hand holding out and a heart come out. Mm. My man speaks with emotion. I say, we came here to rescue you. We've got to stop the Earl. <laughs> he just looks at you. Is he an animal? Can I cast, like, understand animals or no, something? No, he's not an animal. Also, humanoid. anyone who talks is not an animal. <laughs> I want to say, do you want to <laughs> stick with us and help us help us on our way so you don't get caught like this again? He what? looks at you and nods once. Okay, let's go. Okay, where's the orc guys? Okay, I want to check on the lizard guy as well. Make sure he's okay. Oh, he's part of this. He is not happy. He's like, is this this is always this way with you guys? Is everything start on fire? Yes. yes. That was not us. The enemies I mean, were yes. using fire. No, just fire. lizards. That's all. He's like, you told me you were heroes, and I saw him kill a kitten. That's true. You make actually. a valid That's point. Very yeah. true. We just saved this guy. We're very confused about that we're too, gonna, and we will be discussing yeah, it. Yeah, we're gonna have kumbaya all tonight. We're fine. Okay, that's <laughs> yes, happening. Absolutely. That's happening tonight. Yes, we'll build a fire. No. Ixnail the fire. <laughs> not gonna do that. <laughs> oh, no fire. <laughs> we'll build a nice pool. Yes. We'll sit on uh, yeah, next to the pool tonight. We're going to have a team yeah. meeting about kittens. Yes. Okay. I just want to make sure he's behavior. okay, that he's feeling all right. Does he need anything? He's like, I'll stick with you for now. When did all you right. become like the grandma of the I know. I just want to add. I'm taking care of everybody. You know what I mean? Let's stay together, guys. <laughs> Don't go, Frojo. Don't go. Everybody's, uh, yeah. All okay. Right. Okay. I think I'm recalling my old days of being part of a crew on a ship. That's what it is. Were your And shipmates. as a bard on a ship, it was very much, it fell to me to keep the morale up. So I think that's what it is. I'm just okay. kind of going back to my All right, what are y'all doing now? I think we go find a wall for me to climb because I got about an hour and a half left to do that. <laughs> so, well, there's walls everywhere let's here. Go. Yeah. There's a ceiling. You could, you, as everyone's walking, you could climb on a ceiling if you want. I will leave the building that way. On I go the up ceiling. the wall, over the ceiling, down, out the door. The room, you mean? Yeah, yeah that's we're fine. We're in a building, right? Aren't we're we in a room. The whole building. thing is a giant structure. Mm -hmm. You're in. There's a big hallway, and this you're in a room off the top. Also, this is way. all underground. Is there any way we can like track any tracks or trails of where these? No, because the gone? the ground is made of like stone, so my locate, there's no trail. My locate object spell. Do I have to have seen the object? Was there that? really only like one way out of this, or? Well, the, the pathway has been gone and curved. It's about to curve again. Are you guys going to continue? I think we should continue. So my, my locate object spell. My here. locate object spell. Yeah. Do I have to have seen the object? Yeah. <laughs> yes. I, I, well, again. It says an object within a thousand feet as well. What I would recommend is 
between sessions. All you have to do is type locate object. I have it all. It just didn't print. I don't know what I printed. It will tell you exactly no, what like it I does. have all of that already in. It just didn't print. Uh, you have to have seen it up close, and it has to be within a thousand feet of you. Yeah. Okay. Within uh, a thousand okay. feet. Okay. All right, I say we keep going down the path. All right, so when you get there, there's a T, and so the path continues forward, and it's like rubble up ahead. To the side, though, you see some more guards. It looks like another camp is set up, and they are avians, which you have run into a few before. Oh, but these are not birds. cardinals. These are more like ravens. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Are they the same... Guards, you said guards? Yeah, there's, it's set up the same way the other guys were. There was a line of guards protecting. Here's another line of guards. Yeah, these guys are just guarding the passage, right? I mean, they're not going to attack us or anything. They're, they're not. They, they they kind of they indicate that they've seen you. Okay. The line uh, is well, it's not pass. You either go down to where they are, or you continue down to the path where the rubble right. is. So I haven't rubbed should, my coin today. I can do that. I'll rub the coin today and see if that I have works. an inclination so, one way or the other. It doesn't do anything, your coin, right now. Even though I'm thinking about the no, nothing magical happens. object. This is a useless coin. I understand. <laughs> has two sides, by the way. I know, I say, but I don't have a question to ask him. Good day. Um, we're looking to try to... Um, You're going to have to get close enough to them. Okay, I'm going to walk over to them. Scream okay. Them. <laughs> um, so they're there. They're, they're more... They're less amiable than the other ones there. They like... like what, do, what do you want? Um, have you seen any strange groups passing this way? Maybe led by an orc. <laughs> they start kind of chuckling at each other. Yeah, we have an orc. Oh, did you capture one? Uh, yeah, he came through here, tried to steal something. We took him down. He's in our prison right now. I'm like, great, we're on the same team. We fight the same the same enemy. Did he have any babies with him? Uh, yes, we have them too. They're also in the jail. Okay, we would Are like you, to what, pay Did the babies you steal stuff too? Or to like, purchase do you normally jail babies? babies. We're trying so to there's some discussion, and one of them hops away, like, you know, a bird's hop. Bum, 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 what bum. a nerd! <laughs> <laughs> I say to no one in particular. <laughs> <laughs> and they come back with their, their chief, and his, his chief's... <laughs> Is he hopping back also? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you tried to start... No, no, no. She's like, the chief is very hostile to her. He's like, what, what, what do you want? We'd like to negotiate... Uh, the release of the babies. Yes. Also, yeah, magic yeah, items. Don't forget the magic release items. The baby. We want our baby back. Killers, <laughs> <laughs> baby back ribs. <laughs> yes. Huh? <laughs> You're supposed to repeat it. You're supposed to say, "I want we my baby back." Baby back. I was hoping someone else. Baby back. Baby back. Because there's two of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the, the, the chief says, "Give us a second and confer." He's like, "These people are dangerous." He's like, "We'll give them to you, but we have some we have some restrictions." He says, "We'll give them to you, but you have to promise that they'll never come back here mm -hmm. because he tried to he he stabbed one of our birds." Oh, oh we don't want him. The baby. Like the, baby the, baby? the baby. He said, "The the, the guard." Well, the we guy. don't want the guy. Wait. We want the baby. Yeah, you. Keep He's like, guard. "No." He's like, "You take them all or nothing." Can you just finish him off? He's like, you could deal with him any way you want. Fine. Okay. All right. All right. He's like, but you need to do us a favor. We don't need money. We need a favor. Mm, he okay. says, around the corner in a in a in a storefront uh, in a, in a building front there, in one of the rooms, there's a monster that's been preying on us. Go kill it, and these guys are yours. Okay. Will we take the orc? We Why, can you tell us about this monster? Yeah. 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 What, what kind of monster? What are we dealing with? He's like, oh, we don't know what it is. It's just a giant monster. Just it moved in, set up camp. What's it look like? So he starts like. Yeah, that's okay. Give me anything. Here, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what color is it? Or a bird's colorblind? The bird. <laughs> oh my word. <laughs> just saying. You know he says I mean? it's brown. It's brown. He says it comes out day or night. Not that there's day or night here, and then they all squawk and laugh. <laughs> That's a good one. Uh, how many mouths does it have? One. But so it's you've a big seen one. it? Yes. Right, how so many feet? He says one of our people died to it. He says we were going to go attack it, but there's not enough of us left to do so. We need to know like how big, right? I mean, like yeah, these I mean, kinds of no, things. No, I want to know more. Like, if we do kill it, how are they giving us uh, the the auric back? Is it going to? Uh, is it going to be? Are you auric? auric? My I name is auric. What is it? Squizzic. What? Squizzic is an orc. An orc. Oh, it's, he's an orc. Oh, okay. So the bird says this. He says, well, if you kill him, this creature you and bring us his head, he says, we will give you both the miscreants. We will give you both of the babies. 
He says, upon our words as birds. And then he's like, <laughs> which is a very honorable thing right. for birds to do. He has sworn a great oath. Will one of you join us in our fight? To, will one of you go with us to make sure that he stays in the restraints? The orc? Shouldn't we all go in numbers? I don't want to get the orc because the orc's going to turn on us. Do you have a canary? He's, He's going to be in first. <laughs> We can just go to the jail cell and just blow him up. He's gonna be restrained. <laughs> I'm assuming. He hasn't said that. Look, we can We're slaughter him. No, he said we'll bring him out tied up. Yeah, who cares? We're gonna kill him okay. immediately. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna kill him. Yeah, okay. You, do you happen to have a cat outfit, like some sort of <laughs> hidden suit? I listen very intently to the answer to this question. <laughs> All right, here we go. I, we fight All right, we go monster. fight him. Yeah. We'll find the monster. Well, do we need to like heal or anything? Or One or? of the birds oh. says, "I'll show you where it is," but I'm leaving once the fight starts. Yeah, I'm at nine. We should probably heal. Let's wait. Do you have any the cabbage? monster has been here for a long time. Hmm? This, this monster has been bothering you. No, just moved in the last few days. Oh, brother. Does it ever come up to where you guys are now and bother you? Where do you? He sleep says it, it, it says it comes up, sniffs, and leaves. Oh boy. <laughs> Eats, shoots, shoots and leaves. <laughs> 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 is, it, is it a panda? <laughs> um, we should heal. We should heal before yeah, we go. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, How we'll do you deal heal? with it, but we need we need some accommodation yeah. for one night. Or we'll take care of your yeah. problem. Too sweet. He's like, you can stay in this abandoned room, and it's right inside where the guards are. Yeah. So they make two lines, one guarding the outside and, and a couple more to keep you guys from coming into the camp farther. It says you can stay in there. It's just hard ground. Frosh is like, don't worry, I have some pillows. This guy is awesome. He has three. Big. F not a big fan of him anymore. <laughs> what do you think? Math. Do we rest? I think we have to rest. Hey, we yeah, rest. we'll say we'll do it tomorrow. I'm a nine. I don't think we can do it tonight, but you guys also have to keep guard on our room so we can all get a full night's rest. All right. Tomorrow we kill that thing. Uh, okay, so I eat a mushroom. So you rat? Are you eating a mushroom? <laughs> it's a new day. I'll forget if I don't. Oh, no, 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 no. You already ate a mushroom yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you just rested. No, wow. It's oh, wow. Okay, okay, rest. Rest. okay fine. You're you skipping the cutscene, okay? <laughs> oh, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's okay. morning time. Wow. You can't skip the, the cutscene. guys scene. are like, are you going to go? I got to eat first. Sykes, son, we just wanted to sleep. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> da, da, da. No, I'm kidding. Kidding. Oh, I get the speaking with animal ones again, right? The purple. No, you can understand any language for two hours. Any language for two hours. Okay. Let's go talk to the monster. That's fair. Okay. All right. So the bird leaves We're you. And he, he's he's quivering. His feathers are like a couple feathers actually fall out. That's how nervous he is. As right. he walks around and he points and no, you see he, he, he one of the rooms and you see the windows are smashed and there's like a like you hear something snoring from inside. He's like, there it is, and then he runs and hops away. Okay, good. Hold on, it's sleeping. Oh. Okay, all right. We're gonna do some stealth. I've um, got stealth. Not a lot, though. So this is—we know this is a bad beast. Do we? Yeah, yeah, we think so. Or a monster. We're saying monster, it's so we know it's bad. I think oh, no, we think. I don't think we need to be like humanitarians on this okay. one, right? So we just go in like thunder wave. Is everybody okay with that? You don't want to see where we're hitting first. Oh, I do, sure, but I'm saying it's sleeping. We don't have to be like, That's it true. might be good. We're not doing that right. this no. time, right? No. Okay. 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 All right. Well, well, sure, I know I try to be a humanitarian sometimes, but, you know, I like to burn things than heal them. I'm kind of... All right, so do I jerk. go... So, I don't know what my thunder wave I have one particularly is, so. good move in my back pocket that you guys don't know about. That is, I can cast blindness. Well, now we do. Oh, oh, that's nice. Okay. I well, let's find you, out. Yes. Yeah, yeah, let's find <laughs> out. What? Said, well, now we're oh, doing yeah. I guess I, I, just, I just told you. Do we roll for initiative? Is it now in your front then? pocket? Like, I don't know how this works. Well, there is no initiative because you guys can do whatever you want. Yeah, yeah, nothing has happened so far. Oh, okay, sleeping. okay. Okay, so right, are we we're looking gonna, in there? We want to look in there and see what this thing looks like. How close are you getting? I've got a bow. I've, I want to ready my bow. I'm just get okay, ready you're ready your bow. That's fine. I'll right. tell you how close. 30 feet. <laughs> All right, 30 feet, you see like a mass of fur and you see them going up and down. You also see half a bird. Like, like, like the size like of the Like one of them, people. yeah. Like, like the other half is all hidden leftovers. under the body or like? Oh, there's a lot of blood laying all over the place. Okay. It's a lot of leftovers. Okay, got it. Okay. That's okay. Okay. All right. Does it have claws then, this thing? It looks like a It's baby. hard to tell because it's curled up in a ball. Can we all surprise attack it? Let's go. Can we do that? Let's burn What's it that? up. Surprise, surprise attack? attack it, yeah. Yeah, like we, you can shoot. Uh, I can shoot too. I have a I'm long bow at the same time that you do up. your thunder. Like, thunder are we going? 
What, how do you know what the Thunder this Raid did? This is not a good time? moment. Uh, can I push the string back in him? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not we much. told you, don't there pull that string. He's not See, good yeah. at stealth, you know? He's got one weakness plus his... He's like, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm tell ready, I'm ready! Hold on, hold on. Tell him to ready his daggers as... And at the side of his voice, the the bear, the thing's... Uh, you know, quivers okay, a little bit. Right. It's a blast. Yeah, I'm talking right. about So we're all You good. wait for me to call you. You stay right here, and when I say, Elfon, go, then you attack him, but not until I say that. I'm ready to right, so uh, we all it. Yeah, yeah so we all three ground. attack it while you blind it? I can blind it. it all happens at the same time? Sure, yeah. But with the first thing, wake it up. All right, roll for damage, everybody who's attacking. I'm uh, bird damage. pooping it. Oh, that's right. Um, um, pooping what it, not number is that? 20 feet, 20 always. He said damage, so am I doing Oh, you're not D8? missing, you can't Four miss? Four. Okay, yeah, 1d8, yeah. Is that that one? Yeah. 1d8 plus 1. No, you need to roll the hit. Oh, you yeah. Need, yeah. Because, oh, because you still get through armor. Okay. Right. Oh, well, I missed. And then I'm using Like, you hit, but it bounces off. Think of it that way. So I, I got 7, so I assume I miss. 7. 7, Tom? I assume I miss. That did not hit it. Okay. I got 20. A natural 20? No, no, not natural twenty, just regular twenty. What did you th What did you throw? Uh, fire, fire bolt. Oh, fire bolt. Okay, roll for damage, Joey. Same with you. Well, I got a seven. I missed. Yours did not hit. Z, what's your thing called? Blindness slash deafness. Got it. All right, let's see how that works. It works for uh, one minute. I also want to use my quicken spell. Oh, they have to make a constitution saving throw. Another attack so against it's before a sleep. anything else happens. Sure, but it's still you just that doesn't mean it doesn't have a constitution of being blinded. Man, All right. poke his eyes out if it doesn't work. What is the con what is your uh oh, wait. actually I, I can My uh, constitution? No, I need to know what your What does the D C check uses. is? The, yeah, what's your D C check? That's what I'm looking for. It should say it by the spell, I, I don't think. know what that is. Or do you have to roll to give it that? I don't know what D C check is. That's basically what the monster has to roll to not, to not get blinded. All right. Well, you know what? I don't know. That was close enough. The monster awakes in a frenzied and spins around, snarling. So this is what the monster looks like. <gasps> That's gross. Oh, oh, okay. Man. It comes roaring out. As it, it has no eyes. As so it, cute. No, he has lots of eyes. As, oh, okay. it, as it stands to its feet, having taken some damage from Joey, and there's a little bit of its... A little bit of. I did want to use quick and fire spell, from Roy. so that way my fire thing only took uh, a side action or whatever, so I could also magic missile it if I could. Okay. Um, and as he's huh? What's the monster? This is the uh, um, boombox. So I did. Seven I don't know if I call it that. Eight. Oh, I call it monster bounty. Right here. I'm trying to do. Okay. All right, all right. Or bounty monster. Yeah, the one that they're hitting for a bounty. So in in, to in total, I did 17 damage to it. Hmm? In total, I did 17 damage. No, no, I got that. Um, okay. As he stands to his feet, a, a skull falls out of his mouth. A bird skull? And he roars at you, and the smell of it is Oof. worse than the, the mushroom farts. <laughs> That's that Z was complaining bad. about. That's pretty bad. Gnarly. It's pretty bad. Did, did right. my thing work? It, it does seem to be looking around wildly, but then you see it go. Okay. And it starts moving slowly towards I you guys. Okay, that's still better than. Yeah, absolutely. Right, All right, that was your sneak attack. Let's roll for initiative. All right. There's gotta be Dude, some kind of benefit. I I'm pretty good. Oh, I wish I got my a 20. nine. Oh, now I get a great roll. 22. <laughs> 21. More than wow. 20, 20. 17. <laughs> <laughs> Man, waste my good rolls on What'd that. What'd you roll, Roy? 17. 17? Does he find loose? Oh, I don't know what he does. That's exciting. Where are you going? We're going to find out what he does. I like that. It I'm going to be using this, this Twisted Soul. I don't have a, a card for the other guy um, to to show where he is. Um, <laughs> Roy, what'd you roll? Oh, I rolled 17. Okay. And Fro Show. And Z, you're the number one. Come out, what'd you roll? Nine. Nine. And then oh, 14. I roll, you roll, you roll a 17. That's right. Nope. And, oh, yeah, your lizard friend. Your oh. lizard friend. All right. Here we go. He's. So first is Z, then Joey, then Roy. Then Lizard Guy, who has a name, and I forgot it already. Frismog. Frismog. Then Camilla. 
Then Frosho. Wait, the alien guy doesn't get to do anything? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, after the lizard guy is is the alien guy. Elfon. Elfon one of always goes when Z goes. goes. I'm just doing that from now on. I'm screaming at him. Get in here, boy! Do it! Do do it. Do goes it. Draw your third dagger! <laughs> okay, so I'm going to call to him. I'm going to scream at him, and then I'm going to um, swing my longsword of, of death, I call it. Nice. Here I go. Plus five. By the way, this thing is about the size of a large rhino, maybe a little bit bigger than that. Oof, it's not as enormous. big. Some people think this is the bear. This is not the bear. That's the small. Bear we just was, took out a house. I so. understand that. You Where? Do. Warehouse. Remember? Where? <laughs> that fell uh, uh, 16 is what I rolled. Subtle. <laughs> to hit it, all right, roll for damage. Damage is going to be... <laughs> 1d8 plus 3, okay, 1d8, 1d8, this is 8, no, d8, 1d8, 1d8 plus 3. Do it! That would be 9 total. Okay, come on. That's me. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Joey. Yep. Oh. Alright, here we go. What about Elfin? Oh, Elfin, oh, yeah, what is yeah. Elfin? What are you talking about? I shouted at him like, to jump in there and go, go to town on this thing. He's like, let's go! Once again, what? triple somersault. <laughs> really? <laughs> he he leaps off you, bounces off Joey's head, and yes. leaps on top of the guy's horn and is stabbing him in the back furiously, doing some damage. I love that. We don't know how much. Numbers don't matter here. Is the guy... Oh, dang, it's me already. It won't matter. No, it's me. Numbers won't matter. It's apparently. me. I want to do something different. But Wait, it's me, right? I said next. Oh, yeah, this is our yeah, more gash. Yeah, Go. How bloody is he? Not really? No, no. You haven't heard him that much. All right. I'm use my great sword. He's about to feel pain. No, he's not. All right. Um, I assume a nine misses. A nine does miss. Good good assumption. All right. <laughs> still, still misses. Uh, okay. Um, if numbers don't matter, I'm trying to see what we could do then. What if we could try and trap him? I have like an entrapment. I don't know. So let's see what happens. Him. Okay. We don't know the numbers don't matter, you know. All right, Roy, what you doing? I'm going to uh, make a uh, four-inch in diameter sphere of energy, um, a chromatic orb that shoots out of the sky with lightning damage. Oh, my God, I have to roll. That chromatic thing. damage ball. Let's go. I should throw a disco ball at the guy. Uh, 13 plus 6, so 19. All right, you hit him. Roll for damage. Yes, this is... Uh, disco damage. No, 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 this is... No, 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 disco. 3-8 damage. Ah, chromatic orb, go! This is like a one zone. Yeah. 15? All right, 15 damage. He hits it, he hurts. All right, next. He hurts, sorry. Oh, good, okay, good, The lizard runs forward with a shout. Just so you guys are aware, I've done 32 damage to this guy already. hits the thing, but he hits it on one of its teeth. And it bounces, his sword bounces off. This guy is fairly ineffective, I'll tell you that right now. He right. really is. Drez <gasps> levitates off the ground of you, Pete. Like, oh, oh, he's going yeah. Super Saiyan. He yeah. opens up his hand and a ball of energy comes out. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely is going 112 yeah. damage. I told you. See, this is my And here. misses it. completely. What? Well, that's how the spiders got him, obviously. Uh, wow. Well, yeah. What? He's a fighter, huh? Camilla. He's got something. Yes. Okay, all right. It's your turn. Can I summon one of those? One of the uh, him? I don't know. <laughs> that, oh, I like that. Will you treat? Wow. <laughs> You're such a speciesist. I need to know you what it is. What? Animal. <laughs> <laughs> Can you I be know? eaten? <laughs> she writes a, a wilderness pamphlet. It's just like one leaf flip. Do you look like this? <laughs> if not, flip over. Animal. <laughs> I won't summon him. Um, I will do. Ooh, I want to bludgeon this thing. I think. That's a good call. Yeah. So I'm gonna bludgeon do it. the chalet. La chalet. La. I don't want to say that one. All right. So I do a d20. Plus five. That is gonna be a 16. 16. All right. Roll for damage. Oh. D8. That one. Plus your strength. Plus three. Where's right? my strength? At? That should be it. Your strength bonus. The big number by strength. Two. So your two plus. Oh, and that's probably a plus one. Okay, so, yeah. so I get eight, Ooh. nine, ten. Oh, you yeah. hit it. Roaring so in anger. Thirteen. Yeah. You made him mad. Okay. Hey, yo. All right, Fro Show. Oh, my otter's gone. Right? A that fork out of his bag. <laughs> <laughs> I love his bag, man. And throws it. 
Oh, oh. Okay, Frosha just rolled a one. Oh, oh no. Frosha. How's losing? your girlfriend doing? Oh my word! Wow. That to he slips on his five. robe, his yeah. thing, and falls, and the fort well, clatters to the ground next to him. Do I always use this? Yeah, I guess. All right. I down. Down. The giant creature yeah. is going to roll, but he's going to roll with disadvantage because he can't see. He's just swiping with his oh. paw across. All right. Well, that's a natural twenty. No. Oh, no. Wait, on both. You said disadvantage. Oh no, you're right. You're right. <laughs> no, you're right. But it, he still hits you, Joey. And. He had, who else was close to him? You ran up to him also. So yeah. he's hitting Joey I and Camilla. Yeah. I'm always in the back. Okay, okay. he yeah, hits you both. You Call you damage you. four. Uh, 14 damage each. Oh dear. What? All right, so did, I'm Do you see the thing? I know, he rolled with disadvantage. Because he's, he's blind. He and can't he see, but, it, but if he hits you, it's still going to hurt. Ooh, 14 he damage. No, not you, also? just, just Camilla and Joey. So I'm down oh. to four damage. That's you did a, like four health. I hit him with a long sword. Okay. I was right on him. Oh, then you also take the 14 damage because he's swiping everything Maybe in his path. Maybe a range would work uh, better. You know. Guess so. All right, but no, right. I, did, I did 16 damage Z. or whatever. Over on, to you. So. Ooh. Okay, there we go. Is this thing a dragon for chance? It is not. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get any ideas. I, mean, I could do acid on him. You, you, yes, you I can do, do acid. i do that next time. Try something different. Oh, man. Jeez. All right. <laughs> let me see. All right. Where are we? Joey, meet Shield Evans. I know. That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, I got to use my longbow more. Wow, man. All this right. I'm rough. backing off. Okay. And I'm going to just use line, my man. darts on him. So I can't all sit in the back. I, mean, I got yeah, to take some more yeah, hits here. The float has built into it a... Yeah. <laughs> Alright, roll for hit. Okay, then what I have to roll to hit is going to be uh, plus four. That's eight. Okay, no. the darts bounce off him. Alright, Joey. Oh, that's good. Alright, I'm right. going to... Yeah, let's see. If I disengage, then he gets an attack, right? No, that's... You uh, ran away last uh, time. No, Are you kidding? Me. You know what? Fine. Yeah. That's what I thought. Oh, yeah, yeah, suck it up. Oh, yeah. Camilla gave you some encouraging words. I use my yeah, yeah, inspiration. You know that you're the oh, bard. You know you're the one who's supposed to yeah, be doing sorry. it. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, what's your encouragement? Yeah, sorry. Jeez. A bardic inspiration <laughs> for everybody. There we go. Okay, you're inspired. Yeah. You're inspired. Where's Stop my... Stop saying you're in. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> you're in... Inspired. <laughs> Where is it? I know I can do it four times. That's like times. the main thing a bard does. I know. Not this bard. bard just stands there I'm and tells a doll to go fight for him. That's yeah. like a kind of bard. Ever, ever since he got the elf. Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> Where Where you go, it? Joey. The elf. So oh, the yeah. elf does a legolas move and slides down the horn <laughs> of the thing. <laughs> and he's going to try to stab the... Where him in the it? nostril. Yeah, it does not out work. His nose. Ugh. But it makes, okay. it, it makes the beast mad and, and he shakes an elf and falls underneath it. I know I have right. bardic inspiration somewhere. I can't find it. When this prints out, shouldn't it put bardic inspiration somewhere? Fine. It's bardic inspiration. Here we go. Four. Long rest. A creature other than myself gains an inspiration die, which is a 1d6. They can add it to one ability check, attack roll, or saving throw. Right. So you can roll a, an extra die. So I went, whoop, and I missed, and I was immediately but like... But you were playing as you did <laughs> it. I will that. You can shoot the dart while you're playing. <laughs> All right, here we go. What? So. <laughs> What's a creature? Are we Y'all are creatures. Do you look like this? <laughs> Animal. <laughs> That's like, I didn't know that side. What do I look like to be a creature? You're, no, you're everything. Is, it's everything. Unless it's your incorporeal, and even that's a creature, I suppose. Yeah, everything. Joey, you have it. Everybody's got it. And what is bardic inspiration? You can add a d6. Unless you're not fighting. Right, you can add a d6 to your hit roll. roll or to your damage roll. It's your choice. Okay, I so, have a damage roll. Ooh. So I should have done it because you went first, right? Where he you didn't use it yet. right didn't now. Oh, we're on you're the screwed. second time around. You're screwed. I okay. forgot. Okay, I'm a bad bard. You're terrible. Who's a bad bard? Joe, right, are you going to do go. something? I'm doing it. I'm going to attack. I'm using my trip attack, too. I'm using my great sword. My trip attack, though, that means if I do hit, you have to do a strength savings throw. So let's see if I actually do hit. 18 plus 6, 24. So you have to do a strength saving throw of 14. On failure, you're going to be knocked prone. Knocked down. I also do get do damage All right, too, by the way. Thing so hard, it sinks to its knees. Sweet. And my yes. damage is not great. You um, can add a d6 to that if you want. I am going to do that. Just roll the 6 again. Yeah, I guess I have to do the math. All right. 
Nine plus four, 13. The beast Total. is now roaring in agony. Roy. Nice. Can, okay. I, uh, can I add the D6 from Bardic Inspiration to Magic Missile? I don't think so. I'm about to say, Magic So here's what it says, hits. okay? The creature can add it to an ability to one ability check, attack roll, or saving throw. That's not. Oh, it can be added after seeing the roll, but before knowing the outcome. So you can see the first roll before you want to add it. Oh, gotcha. You can't oh. add to magic missile, but you could add it to one of your other magic spells. Okay. Well, I think I'm just gonna do regular magic missile because I don't want to miss. So I'm doing uh, eight damage. All right. The beast is now starting to like. Cry in pain, you, as far as you can tell. Okay. The Good lizard shit. runs up underneath I've it, and he's going to try to stab his sword thing, underneath it. Even though the knees are down, he slides it out. If I know anything about this lizard guy. <laughs> <laughs> he slides directly underneath and stabs upward. Good, uh -oh. good. Yeah, like he's going to die. He does six more damage to it that way. But some of the guts of the, the blood comes down to his face, and he starts yelling as the, oh my gosh, the blood hits him in the useless. face. He's, wow. just, he's got emotional problems. All right. This creature here goes and shoots another ball. While levitating. While levitating. This time he hits. Yes. Guys, finally. We'll see what it does now. Where is it? There it is. I want it to like explode at one of its horns or he something. He does 99 damage to it and it explodes into just like a thousand pieces. <gasps> and I'm not kidding. That wasn't a joke. Yeah! Oh, yes! I love this guy. What is his name? Can I have him? <laughs> I, I freed him. What? You, Animal. You got Fro Show. I do, okay? Don't you ever try Elf to take Fro Show away from me. Oh, you got Elfin. That's the one. Fro Show's like, <laughs> okay. Fro -Show's like dancing around and just drenched in gore. Ah, 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 ah wow. we won and singing, and the other guy's just sitting there underneath him, just completely covered, covered in gore. In nasty, Drag style. Yeah. Yeah. Fro Show's okay. handing out little towelettes. <laughs> to everybody. Oh, nice. Good. Thank you. Oh, good guy. I wasted my bardic inspiration. <laughs> Wow. Oh, but are you asking him what his name is? I'm pretty no, sure it's this. Talk. You said before his name. Orem or something. or oh. Quizik? No. You said his name at one point. I forget what it he was. He has never spoken well, to him. Well, when you oh, asked him, oh, okay. ask him what his name was, yeah. in your mind you just see a question mark. And then you see a guy shrugging his shoulders. <laughs> How's it go? How's it go? That was <laughs> quite the feminine. All right. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, something very cat like. It's a lot about of shoulder. It. What? Dog like. Okay. Okay. Does I give him a hug and I say way. thank you. <laughs> I feel better. I love him. I'm telling you. You should name him. <gasps> oh, he has no what name. I think? I think, can I, I ask him if I can come up with a name so we know what to call and how to refer him? You get a picture sure. of someone nodding yes. <gasps> All right. I'll talk to you tomorrow about it. You get a picture of someone with an eyebrow raised. Okay. So you have I no need time tonight. to come up with something very nice of them. honorable enough. Okay. All right, meanwhile, I like that. Okay. the creature is dead. There's a pile of just gore and bones and stuff. Uh, but what are we supposed to bring back the head? Uh -oh. Yeah, the head is mostly intact, right? The horns are. Okay. Yeah, that works, whatever. All go. right, I mean, he wanted something to do. Have him cut the head off. The Man. head would, might be gone. Oh, dear. I just realized that. The head is gone? What? We made it blow up in a yeah. million pieces. Yeah, that's okay. We have the horns. We'll take back the... They just wanted it gone. I don't think they want that. They don't need the head. Yeah. Were they making soup? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're taking a piece of this. Is it detached? Can we take it? Yeah, yeah. Can I take Let's a tooth just like in my pocket? Yes, you can take a tooth. I want a tooth. A tooth will count as a dagger. Frozo's already taken four. Okay. You mean uh, yeah, Elfon? Me and Elfon, man. Yeah, I'm not getting Oh, Elfon says it's not the same size. I can't do it. No, that's a good call. Okay. I like right. how much of a perfectionist yep. he is. I All want right. that one right there. All right, let's go back and free these babies. Oh All right. Let's, let's go. Get the go. Baby. So you're leaving? The babies. Yep. Oh, oh. Let's check it. I want to check this thing. Was there anything inside of it? Or step all over the place. You can all make a search check if you want. Let's go. Oh, let's search. Let's search. Search in the guts. We got a 16. Dead investigation? 16, 17, 18. 18. 19. What do I add to it? For a search, perception probably. Yeah. Perception. And it's proficient, so do I do 19, 24. It's very, very high, basically. I'm not done. <laughs> yes. I'm not done. 24, 60. 26. Yeah, so you guys found that some, there's a bunch of bloody swords and spears. Of Camilla, you found a, a glowing object. Which is obviously oh, one of these okay. artifacts. It. it is a round. It is a round object about right. this size here, 
um, like this with the hole in the middle, but it's connected with a Y like that. <gasps> Do I recognize it from a dream the other night? Ish. It does seem familiar to you. It's a flux. You need a, you need a full All right, beam. we're talking tonight. We're powwowing <laughs> uh, around. The <laughs> We're powwowing around the pool and having a discussion. I'll tell you about this object that I recognize. Okay. You need a DeLorean. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you're taking it back. It's a Mercedes, yeah. I guess, right? All right as, you round, <laughs> as you round the corner to go back, the the birds let out a cheer when they see you dragging oh, this thing out. Oh, yeah, it's, it's oh, really, oh, it's a little unsettling because it's like, oh, 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 and they're putting their head sideways. One is like a up. bunch of worms falls out of his mouth. He's so surprised. That what? <laughs> a bunch Gross. of chewed up worms. You know yeah. birds eat worms, right? Yeah, they do. Do that. we like? Should we take them to them? No, we don't like right. What's right happening right feet. now? Right when right you get up feet. there, they're so pleased. They're like, "Thank you for killing it. You okay. We're now gonna be able to expand our camp farther." Yeah, man. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah you might creature. want to paint in there first. You um, know? Yeah, I would recommend painting. Uh, he's like, "We got him." So they drag out the. The orc, and with him is a human, uh, a very right. handsome looking human, also tied up with him, and then two crying babies. Okay. Do you recognize the human? No, you don't. You've never seen him before. We say, okay, whoa, whoa, that no, no, was wait, not what, part no, wait, of wait, the deal. Wait, wait. Let's figure out who he is No, first. they told you there was two miscreants. If, were, were they, they together? together? Two or were who they cares? together? Were they we'll traveling together? To They're like, these guys were together with the babies. They're almost carrying each other. Are you one? Did you have them keep the human or was that another one? No, question them. Question the human. Anyway, they give you the guys. He's like, oh, we don't want the other guy. I'm like, who cares? We'll call him if we need to. I mean, kill him. He's very attractive. very attractive. The chief chief looks at you and says, our deal is complete. We have kept our thing. Goes back to his camp. <laughs> bow deeply to him, and they they give you respect, and you're and they say we will we will tell your tales far and wide. Thank you, bird kind. I like that. Um, so while you're saying all that, uh, the orc is like furious. He's like, Wah. do we know this orc? Squizzy. It's been this a while. The guy who stole the babies. It's the guy. Yeah, that was like. Us, uh, right? Okay, so he ago. was with yeah. the group. Yeah. So let me catch you up. He was with the group. Our group? Uh, at the very no. beginning, that group that For you group. met at the very beginning. Oh. And remember the guy died and you weren't sure who killed him and you're pretty sure by process of elimination it was him. He also then choked the other Did person and threw her down the stairs. Yeah. And then he stole the, the he also, Yeah, he also ratted you out to the Hobgoblins yeah. and then he stole the babies. This guy's dying. Quick, we can, also, we can talk about the kids Several later. magic oh, items. Yeah, yeah. I, Where's the magic that? items? He I says, he says I, can I say something? Who no. you or the... No, the, the, the I want to know where the magic items up. are first. Yeah, you can say so. You can Does try. Does have the magic items still? So he looks at Z directly in the lie, eyes cut and he tongue. says, do it now. And that's where we'll finish today. Ah! Ah! I will, does he kill him? We're killing him. It's happening. Is that even mushroom? No, I did. Okay. Oh, I don't know why I just turned off my mic. <laughs> it's still live. <laughs> For a dramatic ending. <laughs> Do it now. Bye. Cut to black. And we're done. All right. Thank you all for watching. This is uh, episode five. We have one more to do. If we'll do more than that, if the Kickstarter reaches a stretch goal. Oh. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget our Kickstarter. Yep. Um, tomorrow from six to midnight. We'll be doing Magic. some fun party games in here and just goofing off and playing games um, to end out our Kickstarter. So we invite you to come join us for that. Tell people we have 36 hours left or so, yes. something like that. Um, a little bit less, actually. Back it. Let's see how many stretch goals we can reach. Thank, Thank you guys you for everyone. watching. Until next Thank time, you. I'm Tom. I'm Z. I'm Camilla. I'm Roy. I'm Joey. And there's a whole bunch of other NPCs. Oh. Yeah. <laughs>